Uh, testing. One, two, three. Testing. Oh, we're live. It's broken. Okay, well, if it's so broken, then why can you hear me? Nice try. Yeah, th that's what I thought. Nice try. <laughs> Listen, lady. Well, you listen here, chat room. All right, I'm not. I'm not taking any of that. Listen here, lady. You listen. You listen to me, chat. We're live and we hear you. Let's go. Why is it called evil jolt, but it rotates the same way as regular jolt? It doesn't. It rotates the other way. Put them side by side. Put evil Joel and regular jo Joel's just side by side. They rotate opposite directions. Or do they? That's what's so evil about it. I'm muting you? Well, go ahead. You're gonna miss out on wonderful commentary and um, really funny stuff such, such, such as uh, that. You wouldn't want to miss out on that, would you? <laughs> so make sure you crank up your volume. That's what I do to get anyone's attention. It's like, some sometimes when I'm playing video games, people talk over me. So I just play a really loud fart noise and then everyone starts listening intently and I'm like, now that I got your attention... <laughs> As I was saying. <laughs> We're ready to fish. Your mic is a bit low compared to the video game. What if I what if I do this? I haven't figured out how to make my mic get closer to my face without me getting closer to the microphone. This desk is too big. It's too long. I never knew I'd complain about having so much desk real estate, but here we are. I've got all this space for Pokemon cards and all this space for all, all this stream equipment, but I can't put a mic arm anywhere because then it's, it's, it's always too short. <laughs> Penguin, How welcome back! Bozo. Another month, another bench. Welcome back, Bozo. Welcome back to the cage. Thank you for eight months. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Her desk too big for her goddamn mic arm. There's a funny little dial that says game. You think you you don't think I have that cranked to any reasonable amount already, chat room? If I crank that up anymore, I'm gonna be peeking. Here, listen. Um, those of you, loud, loud, loud sound warning, it's the beginning of the stream, I'm allowed to be crazy. Anyways, you won't like this. This baby can go all the way up and it sounds horrible. I'm speaking especially quietly right now too. What do you mean, woo, let's go? I, I saw it peak for me just like kind of whispering. Base boosted ASMR. <laughs> Reverse ASMR. <laughs> I gave you a loud noise warning, chat room. You can't complain if I warn you. And then that puts the onus on you. That's the, the responsibility is put on your shoulders whether you wish to continue to listen after I say I'm gonna make a loud noise. I'm gonna make a loud noise. <laughs> it just sounded like every mic from 1998. Yeah, yeah. When you crank up the gain, it really doesn't sound good. I love games that have open mic because I can crank the gain on my mic and then yell or clap and then blow out someone's laptop speakers. You're that guy! <laughs> you butthole! You're the reason I can't use VoIP in like any video game because there's always people like you who are like 
I'm just gonna play the loudest possible noise over my speakers with my game turned up to maximum with my skull candy microphone. That's you. You're the reason I have tinnitus. You have two brain. I I have a group of gamer friends. I know, chat. You can you can say, oh, Chia, you don't have any friends. Well, I do. I have gamer friends, and I play video games with them sometimes. Um, they can't decide what they want to play though, so they keep starting like Zomboid servers and then stopping. Anyways, anyways, there's one. Um, this is a call out post. They might even be in the chat right now. There's one who always plays music over the microphone. It's fine if you want to listen to music while playing Zomboid, but I don't need to hear it. Who? I'm, I'm not telling you. This, this is a call-out post, though, if you're listening right now. I... I have feelings about when people play music over the microphone. You can think whoever you want to think it is. I'm just telling you, you're you're kind of off the mark, chat. I'm not gonna throw anyone under the, the bus. You have feelings? Yeah, I, I have- I'm an empath. I have a lot of feelings going on. Within me. As an empath, and I, I can sense chat- I can sense you're a little bit stressed out today. As an empath. At least some of you. Maybe you're at work, someone's looking over your shoulder. <laughs> I just associate Zomboid with Beko because she was the first person I saw play it. Beko does love Zomboid. Funnily enough, I haven't played Project Zomboid with Beko yet. I do want to start a VTuber server, but I don't know. The thing about servers like that and like gamer servers and streamer servers is you never know how long they're they're gonna last for like they last as long as the content is farmed and sometimes that's not very long so it could be a lot of setup for like we play it once i'm stressed because i go back to work tomorrow i'm so sorry well take a load off we're, we're gonna be playing some funny relaxing fishing this game is so funny and relaxing and not at all stressful in any sort of way. I will not run into rocks as to up your stress. I will avoid all rocks. She yearns to always make a VTuber server, but the effort- Yeah, I yearn to make a, a bunch of different VTuber servers. I yearn. I yearn for the mines. I feel like Minecraft servers work best. I agree. I agree. Minecraft is always in fashion. It's always in fashion. Everyone always feels like playing it. It's low stress. It's low effort. It's been around forever. Setting up the server is actually not, like, it's not that big a deal. I can just give chat my IP address and then they can just join my server. <laughs> I'm joking, by the way. I know not to give that away anymore. I've been drawing up a storm today. My hands are already, like, I've started the stream with pre-cramped hands. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. I must look like a bit of a freak when I'm at my desk, because I'm just, I'm wiggling my fingers all the time, trying to, like, limber them out. So, like, someone will just walk past and I'll be doing, like, crazy fingers. I'll be like, I'm, I'm not crazy, they just hurt. I just gotta stretch him. <laughs> it looks like I'm trying to like cast a spell or something. I'm there at my desk going like. <laughs> you don't have to give it. We already have it. You have my IP address, chat. Well, yeah. I guess that makes sense. I probably give it to you guys at some point, probably for safekeeping. You better not tell anyone. Okay, or I'll I'll kill you in Minecraft. Don't mind if I do hints before grabbing something. 
<laughs> Don't mind if I do. <laughs> oh, that's nice. You, you really can't go wrong with an egg sandwich. I used to work at a restaurant and like the most ordered thing off the menu was in fact just an egg sandwich. It was just a- it was an egg, some uh, aioli mayonnaise, lettuce, herbs and stuff. What- what else? Tomat? There was a bit of tomat. It was pretty simple but it was tasty and sometimes people would ask for bacon. That was our top seller was just an, a yield egg sandwich. I love that, as Chia goes around her house grabbing trinkets like a goblin. Okay, uh, that, that feels a bit personal because you know why? There's more truth to that than you might have even thought initially. I kind of do that already. My dad does it and I think I picked it up from him. My friend observed that when I want something, I do wiggle my fingers a little bit at it. And she goes, Chia, that's so... That's so funny. Like, I started doing it. It's contagious. So now she started doing it. Now we're all just a bunch of, like, when we hang out and we want something, we're, like, pointing at it while wiggling our fingers. <laughs> it's spreading. It's a, it's a mind virus. As soon as you start doing it, it's hard to stop. I don't know why. It just... It conveys so much emotion, I believe. Trinket grabber Andy? Listen, who doesn't want to grab trinkets? I love trinkets. Which behavior? <laughs> well, um, might I might I direct your eyeballs to the tags? Yeah, you might you might see Hag in there. Better get finger tracking for those wiggles. <laughs> That'd be so embarrassing. <laughs> And then chat would actually see when I do point at my monitor like a goofus, like anyone can see me. Because sometimes I, I, I do that, like, I, I talk a lot with my hands, I do it right now, I'm doing it right now. But like, sometimes I point at something like, look at that chat. And I'm like, oh yeah, no one can see me. That'd be so embarrassing if you guys did in fact see me. <laughs> In like three years time or some shit if Chia ever gets a full 3D model with tracking we're gonna see all the goofy pointing and, and finger wiggles. <laughs> I'm a pretty dynamic person when it comes to body language so yeah you'd see all the wiggles. You see all the fingy wiggles. All the hand talking. It's content? Yeah it is content. You'd be like, oh my god, I can't believe she does that, and then you're gonna start doing it, and then you go, oh my god, I see why she does it. Her secret Italian heritage. <laughs> uh, no, no, I don't think I actually do have any Italian heritage. I don't think so. I am just a generic Caucasian, so maybe. But it's mostly Scottish. generic <laughs> I'm just generic brand no name you get at the grocery store that's me <laughs> oh no I don't even mean Scottish in quotations my, my dad is from Scotland so <laughs> oh, you're, you're saying it's slander to call Scottish generic? Come on, come on. Every every Caucasian person goes, yeah, I'm I'm, my, I'm Scottish. I, I'm Scottish. And they all say they're Scottish when they have, like, one grand, great-grandpappy who came from Scotland. Oh, yeah, I'm Scottish. I wear, I wear kilts. Haha. <laughs> they're not, in fact, Scottish. They, they're just American. No one says that? No, it, it is a thing. It's definitely a thing. I heard on the bus recently, a man kept calling himself Scottish. He was like, I'm from Scotland. And 
he, I believed, he, he told his whole life story on the bus to a stranger, and I, I just so happened to be in the listening vicinity, so I was subjected to it. He was like, I was, I was born in Scotland, but all his whole family was from Canada, and he was from Canada, so like, in my mind, you're Canadian, buddy. <laughs> Stolen Scottish valor. Everyone's Scottish. Everyone's Irish on St. Patrick's Day. It's like that. It's, it's exactly like that. And when they're not Irish on St. Patrick's Day, they're Scottish every other day. Aren't Americans always claiming they're part Irish? Never heard of Scottish? Well, okay. So, I used to work as a bouncer and an usher at a theater. One of the conventions was, um, I think it was a 23 and Me. It was one of those heritage ones. I was, uh, I was on the inside ushering at the time, and, um, they combine Scotland and Ireland together in those DNA tests because there is no distinction. So there you go. There is, in fact, no distinction. Genetically. It's just cultural at that point. <laughs> They're interchangeable, I guess, according to those little DNA tests. I never took one of those. I'm scared to take one of those. What if I find out I have some horrendous disease or something? I used to work as a bouncer to you outside the club's like, no seats, no entry. It was for concerts that I was I was bouncing. It was just mostly, ma'am, you can't bring that alcoholic beverage into the theater. And that was that was the extent of it. People came up with some creative ways to try to convince me that they could bring their drinks into the theater. <laughs> like, oh no, no, this is just water. I'm like, okay, well then you won't, it won't hurt you to leave it outside, will it? And then they look defeated. They're like, oh shit, she got me. Yeah. <laughs> in the suit looking at you like no entry yeah we even had the the earphones that security uses and walkie-talkies it was so cool I felt so cool working at that job all like five foot I'm five foot five chat I'm not any shorter if you hear otherwise then that's that's just chat propaganda but it says on my driver's license anyways anyways all five foot five of me dressed head to toe in black with the with the headphones on I just needed aviators at that point no, I did not rummage through seat cushions for leftover snacks. Snacks were even allowed in the theater, and if I did my job right, there would be none. <laughs> Woman lit. Five five is average. Last time I checked. In fact, I it might be above average in Canada. It might be five four. That's average. <laughs> yeah, but you're five three. No, uh, it says on my driver's license that I am five five. Why would the government lie to me? Are you trying to say I lied to the government? Dermatier Kobe, shut up, shut up. I'm, I'm 5'5". Five five. On a tall day, I'm 5'5". Five five. When I have my shoes on and I stand up really straight. Not even on my tippy toes. I got you something? What did you get me? <gasps> Hati, I'm scared now. What did you get me? Feel like I'm 5'5 five five when I jump. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, is this it, Kati? Kelby MG, thank you for the raid. Welcome, raiders. Welcome, welcome. Could we get a shout out for Kelby here? <gasps> Eggie! Anza! Hello, everybody. Hello. 
Welcome, we're fishing. Nothing weird going on here. I didn't I didn't lie on my driver's license about how tall I am to feel taller. If chat says otherwise, they're a bunch of liars. Don't listen to them. They don't even know where they are. I think most of them are in fact demented. I you know, I I attract the retired demographic at this point. So don't don't even don't pay attention to them. Anyways, fresh blood welcome. <laughs> At least you have a license, mine expired. Eggy! Eggy, those take like five years to expire and they're like zero effort to renew. Eggy! Eggy, how did that happen? There's even like a grace period after it expires to go get it. It's like a six month grace period or something. Eggy, come on. <laughs> it's okay, I'll, I'll drive you, get in the car. Get in the van, Eggy. I'll, I'll drive you around. Can I let you in on this secret? I haven't drove in quite a long time. I don't own my own vehicle. I just have a license so I can drive. But like, I just, I hope it's something like a bicycle, like you just never forget. <laughs> yeah, get in the Uber. Yeah, welcome everybody! Um, if you haven't heard of this game, it's called Dredge. It's a fishing game. It's a lot like Sunless Sea. Like, closer to Sunless Sea than I even thought, but with fishing mechanics. So it's a lot of fun! If, if Sunless Sea was up your alley, then this will be right up your alley. It's the same kind of atmosphere. Also, my name is Chia. I'm a hamster VTuber. I play Super Auto Pets on Sunday. If that's what you were doing. Kelby, what were you doing? Were you playing Super Auto Pets? I hope you had a good stream. Welcome, Bozos. She doesn't know? Uh-oh. No, I do know how to drive. At least in a pinch, I hope I, I will, uh, I will remember how to drive. Okay, I'm caffeinated. I'm ready. What were we do even doing? We had quests? I really need more ship space. Okay. I haven't read this yet. You gotta pass time to read? Okay. I guess that makes sense. Nighttime is upon us. I'm no longer afraid of fishing at night. I used to be so afraid. Oh, thank you, Bing Bong. I am a sap fiend. I rarely venture out of that category. <laughs> I thought so. I thought so. I love Super Auto Pets so much. It is really just... I, I can't name a more perfect game. Like, Super Auto Pets is the game I just keep going back to. Whenever I'm bored, I'm like, I could always play Super Auto Pets. Minesweeper, you, that's heresy. Shut, shut your freaking face. I don't think anyone knows how to play that. I don't think anyone here knows how to play that. Everyone's just... making it up. How long does it take me to read? Zero percent? What am I doing? Whatever. Whatever, I don't need to read, do I? I'm a sailor after all. Here's my fish encyclopedia. I don't know what this crab is, but I've circled it and read a bunch. <laughs> I do? Well, everyone who says that they know how to play Minesweeper are just... feds. They're just feds. And you know what a fed would say? They would say that they're not a fed. And that they in fact know how to play Minesweeper. That's- that's how you know. She is so pretty she doesn't need to read it. <laughs> So what's, 
the details on this game. I only know Sep. This is... Have you ever played Sunless Sea? This is a kind of, um... Lovecraftian experience. I wouldn't say that it's just like straight up Lovecraftian horror, but you fish. The fish are a bit weird. There's some weird stuff happening. There's some, some interesting characters in the game that definitely have some weird backstories. The, the best I can describe it right now is just weird, and I assume it's going to keep getting weirder until we had a, a point of no return where everything is just absolutely strange. I don't know where it's going to go. We're kind of near the beginning. Fishing but weird. I like it. Let me show you the fishing mechanic. I will go out at night. This is how you make moolah. Also, this is how you run into rocks. You look for those weird little shiny bits. Then you play a little fishing game and then you catch a barbed eel. A perfectly normal and real eel. It was a trophy fish too. You're excited to see what this is? It, it's, it's nice and relaxing, but also a little... The best way I can describe it right now is just strange. A strange atmosphere. She's cracked. Oh yeah, I'm so cracked. Cracked in the head. It, I know cracked now means like you're really amazing at video games. But like, there was a point, and I keep coming across it in books, where cracked means that you're just insane. You're crazy. You're cracked. You're like, like an egg cracked open. Your brain isn't all there. Yeah, the aesthetics are beautiful. <sighs> what is it? What's with the fog around here? By the way, the fog makes you a little bit crazy. Don't worry about it. I'm sure it doesn't mean anything. Never understood why cracked became a synonym for good player. I don't understand why a lot of like zoomer slang is the way that it is, but it is. It just is. No wonder I'm so dumb. Eggy, no! Cracked means crazy. It's no wonder you're so crazy, Egg. You're not dumb at all. I am cracked at video games because I am cracked insane. <laughs> Nobody knows. It changed recently. It lingers in the mornings now. Where before, it didn't seem to have the strength. Even in the midday sun, I feel it. A malice concealed in shadows. Waiting for a night to sweep the island. She glances up at the lighthouse. <sighs> if this light should ever falter, then gods help us. Thoughts. Rut row. Tell me you're fond of me, lobster. I've seen it in your eyes. That eyeball probably means means I should I should do a little bit of resting, but let's just sell these fish first. There you go, enjoy. Do I want some more crab pots? Our other ones are probably gonna break. I'll take a couple. I've got the finances. I'll take one, I'll take one. Do a little rest. Every day I wake up. Who is she talking to? I'm talking to you guys. Am I? Why did I check to see if the stream was like started? Oh my god, I feel I feel like I just wandered out of a dream just now. What you like induced a dream state in me by saying that? <laughs> Hello everybody. Hello. Are you a K streamer? I don't know. The Shia tradition, playing a slightly nautical game and immediately turning into William Defoe from the lighthouse. <laughs> Hark! 
It is bad luck to kill a seabird. That's my go-to. You know the lighthouse was filmed really close to where I grew up? Yeah. That's like Chia heritage right there. What, what am I doing? Hold on. Okay, so we now have map markers and we have little X's to go to. Let's go to this one up there. Oh, I just dropped them on my body. How do I get rid of them? Remove. Remove them, please. That's cool. I was hoping I could, like, manipulate them a bit, but... We have to go there and then we can drop them. Drop them like our anchor. I love how deep in your brain the lighthouse is, to be honest. Can tell you really freaked with that movie. Yeah, that movie is like part of my psyche now. Like, dare I say, to me, the lighthouse is just the perfect movie. I don't ever want to watch it again. I've watched it twice in my life. I didn't even want to watch it the second time. Because it, it is, it is unnerving and it is gross. <laughs> it's just steeped in like, it, it's so steeped in nautical superstition. And it's, it's the superstition that I grew up with as well as someone who grew up on the coast next to like a bunch of fishing villages so it, it just I, I fricked with that movie yeah, I fricked with it hard I think about it sometimes yeah it, it sticks in my brain and I think one of like the best parts is having like Robert Pattinson another like an actor kind of from my childhood like I was pretty young when the Twilight movies came out and he was just the Twilight guy but but now he's just absolutely beloved Oh, what's in my crab pot? No, okay. Well, a little guy, that's fine. Ooh. I want to go up there, and then we're going to come back. I'm not going to stop and waste my time fishing. I don't want to use haste either just yet. I think tomorrow? Tomorrow we might try to make our way all the way to the gale cliffs and we will use haste during the day. I don't want to go crazy. I don't want to go crazy, so that's what we'll do. I mean, then again, the damn movie takes place like millimeters from your house. It's based on an island that is, I believe, off the coast of Ireland? That's where the original lighthouse story came from. It was three lighthouse keepers. Um, they very suddenly vanished. They had plates set out like they were going to eat. A lot of, like, a lot of scientists now believe it could have been a rogue wave. So just a very big, one of the, like, the largest ever recorded waves over the island. Could have just washed them away. Anyways, it, that, that whole story is steeped in a lot of nautical superstition as well. People are like, it was sea monsters, it was... They angered Poseidon, and Poseidon took them back to the ocean. And the lighthouse is kind of based on that sort of superstition. Yeah, you definitely would have heard about the lighthouse keepers from a spooky story on YouTube. That one is out there in droves. You really don't want to anger Poseidon. No, you do not. You definitely do not want to anger Poseidon, and good thing I am in Poseidon's good graces. I'm docking. Did 
This is the island where the builder wants materials delivered. Okay. So we need two metal scraps, two planks of wood. I know where to get some wood. And we'll just find scrap around. I saw a little stinky, a little stink pile over here. A little funky fish. Let's see what it is. Can I even fish here? Yes, I can. Grotesque mackerel. Yeah, I guess it's a bit strange looking. Mackerel aren't worth a lot. It's my it's my most likely to throw back overboard fish. If I were to make a fish tier list, mackerel would be the most likely uh, the most likely I would throw back overboard if I needed to make space for anything. Hello, Nolanka. Chat room, what's your favorite fish ever to eat? I should go back. I should go back. I wanted to go explore that island, but really? I shouldn't risk it. The fog is coming, the fog is coming. The you don't eat fish, Malay. Bullshit. Salmon, that is an S tier edible fish right there. This game plus Chia should be extremely unhinged and weird, but it somehow loops around and becomes comfy. I'm a comfy streamer! I keep telling you this chat, I'm a comfort streamer! I can be your comfort streamer, and I will be, and I hope you're comfortable right now. Salmon is great. It's hard to argue with salmon as, like, one of the best edible fishes. I guess we could stop here. I am. Good, 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 good. I can be your Oshi and your Noshi. You. That's a, that's a guy right there. That's a lad. Is there more? Oops. I'm throwing them overboard, I told you. Most likely to be thrown overboard. I'm gonna hit you with a bit of a weird one. I like, I like tuna. I used to hate tuna as a kid because it smelled real rank, but now I'm pretty tuna filled. Like I just, I could just eat it right out of the container at this point. I don't know what like changed within me to desire doing that. Am I gonna be able to make space? Um. And. I don't think so. Discard this guy. We can. We can throw this out. That's all. That's all we need. Don't want to run into the rocks. Let's go around them. Tilapia, that's a good fish. Um, that's kind of taken the place of haddock over the years. I'm a huge fan of- this is a bit of an untraditional tasty fish, but I used to- I used to live in Nunavut. And Arctic char were very, very common there. It's a really tasty white fish. Very light. Just my whole diet when I lived at none of it was pretty much just eating various versions of Arctic char. It was just chowder, fried, you name it, I ate it. Do you eat raw tuna? You uh, yeah, I, in sushi. You you thought you would get me with that? Like, haha, streamer eats raw fish. Yeah, buddy, what's sushi then? 
Sushi is fantastic. Yeah, I, I think Arctic Char might be a pretty Canadian exclusive. They might have it in other parts of the Arctic Ocean. Sushi's meh. You're saying everything's meh. What I'm learning is you got the taste buds of a toddler. Go eat some chicken nuggets. Tension! Hello! You ever heard of Mahi Mahi or Arctic Char? Mahi Mahi! I think I've had that before. <laughs> How are you doing, Tension? Hmm. You know what's better than fish, though? Coffee. Right now, in this moment, coffee. Have you got any crabs? Why, yes! Don't forget, if your crab bot gets a bit worn out, the shipwright would be able to patch him up. Here's your crab, sir. The fishmonger wraps up the crabs and hands you some money. These'll do. Glad you got some use out of that old pot. You can always buy more here. Or repair damage, damaged ones at the shipyard. I have one final request for you. As you've seen, some fish around here can develop odd deformities. What do you think happens to a person that eats the flesh of one of these mutants? You want me to try? You want me to take the bullet? I'll eat it. <laughs> um, probably nothing. Like, it's just a fish, right? Well, perhaps. But I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish. Any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Wait, no, I'll eat it. Don't, you don't have to eat it. I'll, I volunteer. I volunteer. Remember, any aberrant will suffice. I suspect they're all the same underneath. Okay, which one is worth the least? Can I see a price? I'm guessing the mackerel is probably worth the least. I'm giving him the, the least worth fish I possibly can. Eat that shit, gamer. Eat that shit up. Mm -mm -mm. The fishmonger takes the aberrant fish from you. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Oh, he's, he's gonna get in there like Smeagol style. Tasty fishes. Raw and wriggling. Yeah, he really likes to feel the fish, doesn't he? This is the second time he's, he's just been, like, groping a fish in front of me. Can I go now? Can I go? I'm uncomfortable. Also, hello, everybody! Hello, hello! I recently read a book about a fisher who got into all kinds of trouble and kept getting sent to jail recently. It was fire. <laughs> Sounds like a story right there. Some people live just extremely interesting lives. Like, I had a teacher in, in elementary school who just had every sort of job you could imagine. Anything. He would have done it. In his, he, was, he was a bouncer. He was a mortician. He was just... He worked every job, it seemed to me at the time. And now he was a teacher. Can we switch games already? Why? Why are you saying that? Because we're watching a man grope a fish? Get over it, chat. Grow up. This is what men do. <laughs> Joel inspection day. Pull him out, chat. Pull him out. Show me your Joels. It's mandatory Joel inspection. Where are your Joels, chat? Joel check. Was he challenger in League though? <laughs> no, I don't think I don't think League existed when he was a teacher. <laughs> League hadn't come out yet, so no, I guess he wasn't. Yeah, Joel check, Joel check. Pull out your jewels. Nice, chat, nice. That's that's some nice jewels. 
I will now proceed to pleasure myself with this fish. Yes. This should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth. And why don't you take these two? They're of no use to me. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> He's giving me hush money. Sounds like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please. Sell what you need, then leave. I must deal with this creature. Quickly now. Okay. Have fun. <laughs> Have fun dealing with the, whatever you're dealing with. <laughs> Do you moan when you eat sometimes? Chat room! That was once. That was once. Alright, sometimes you do eat something really tasty and you just... Okay, m moving on. Anyone who says that they haven't, is a liar. The fishmonger's door slams behind you. You hear the heavy scraping of a metal bar sliding across it. Yeah, chat room, behave! This is what happens when, when fish groping happens on a, on, a, on a stream. Me doing the pufferfish noise after every bite? Yeah, you ever have food that's just so good, you take a bite and you pufferfish- Ugh. <laughs> you just bite into it and you have to just let loose a- Ugh. It's just so tasty. <laughs> eat fish moly, eat fish moly, eat fish moly, eat fish moly. It sounds like it's saying ew, and I agree. Ew, ew, fish moly, ew. Ew, yucky, icky, I hate fish mole. Eh. <laughs> eh. I should rest. Every day I wake up. Okay, our goal? Gale Cliffs. Let's go there. These are for upgrading. Can I get any upgrades right now? Remember, you don't have all the if you don't have all the materials at once, you can store whatever you want right here at the dry docks. Fish mole, fish mole, fish mole, fish mole. Hola, everybody, hola! We're doing some dredge. We're, we're dredging. Dredging for fish. <sighs> for once, I don't need to repair. I would love a new light. But our fish can't hold all these lights. I should research a faster engine. Ooh. Oh, this one's three, but we have two right now. High quality components and excellent craft craftsmanship, a reliable engine trusted by seafarers. Now it's for sale. Now I gotta buy it. I think it's faster than... Frick. It's not faster than both of them combined. That freaking blows. We need a bigger ship. We need a bigger ship. I can't fit all these engines on one ship. I need a bigger ship for all these engines really is the darkest dungeon of fishing. This really is the Dark Souls of fishing games. 
Can I can I be honest with you, chat? I never played Darkest Dungeons because it was too intense for me. Not not the visuals, not not the like grotesque things happening on the screen. It was just upsetting. And not not upsetting in the ooh I'm so scared kind of way. Upsetting that I think it would have made me really angry to play. Yeah, the RNG. My Oshi. Uh, no, but I watched I watched people get upset at it and then I could laugh. But like if it was me playing it, I would have been the one getting upset. And then other people laughing at me. It looks infuriating. Yeah, exactly. It seemed infuriating. But the aesthetic of Darkest Dungeon, immaculate. The narration, beautiful. I use the voice pack in Dota 2 of that narrator. The Tyler one of VTubers, Chia. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had a stream freak out that, was, that wasn't on purpose. At least the chat's aware of. The voice narrator. Can he narrate my funeral? As they're like jettison jettisoning my body into the sun, can he do the narration? They've loaded the loathsome creature's body onto the ship. As it leaves the atmosphere, it lets loose a shudder. Adios. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll play Darkest Dungeon at 20k subs. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure, sure. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. I'll also do a, a a jig and I will I will eat a shoe and I will Swallow a golf ball hole. I'll, we'll do a lot at 20k subs if it happens in this week. <laughs> Hello. Welcome, welcome. This is, this, you can't, sir, this is a Wendy's. You can't order a Big Mac here. Adios, said the joyful hamster as she walks away from the computer. The screen fades to black, and the audience already yearns for more. <laughs> she will Tyler one maul the darkest dungeon at 20k subs after he leather boot after the leather boot dinner. Yes, yeah, that that's what we'll do. After 20k subs, I will mold like Tyler one. I even have the- I'm working on my head indent as well. Like, I've been wearing my headphones quite a lot. I've been working on my my Tyler 1 head indent for my headphones. <laughs> now, Tony K subs, Chia will spill all food all over herself, like Tyler 1. I will do that for free at any amount of subs, and have. You just can't see it because I am a YouTuber. Whoa! I can go so fast! Yeah, you, what are you doing? Are you trying to Joel inspect me? Um, oh shit, I don't- Chat, can you cover for me? Can you drop some Joels on my head? She a jump scare? Boop! <laughs> <laughs> Arky, that'd be so good. Yes, please. Oh my god, I forgot how tiny the jewel emotes were when they drop on my head. <laughs> alright, alright, enough of that. He's too small, you can't even see him. My jewel is too small. Little shards flying around. I know, it looks like I have dandruff. Okay, are you ready, chat? Hey! 
We can go so fast. Loathsome some hamster. I'm gonna hit you with a hot take. I don't even think that that's all that much faster. This is slow to me. This this isn't Sonic fast. They catch fire over time. Cool. <gasps> Purposes! Can I fish him? Can I run him over with my boat and haul them in after I hit them? Manatee style? No? Okay. <laughs> Be funny if a stretcher deem was just a hamster wheel. Yeah! I'm wondering how we could do that. I do have a gif of me running on a hamster wheel. Chia Jelly Car voice back for this game win. <laughs> You guys are obsessed. If you're not in the Discord, you should be because the almost the entirety of the Jelly Car voice pack is is a soundboard now, so you're welcome. Aren't them dolphins? The emulator? Wow, all these new ports to visit. Can we dock here? Yes, we can. That's a nice boat. Oh. Ahoy there. You're a new face, a fisherman, I take it. Perfect. Well, we should get along like a house on fire. <laughs> Uh, I'm a traveler and a merchant and rolled into one. Uh, I'm a traveler and a merchant all rolled into one. I thought she was talking about... No, never mind, never mind. If you have any fish to sell, I'll take them on board and sell them at the next town I come across. Likewise, a haul... I haul a small cargo of equipment between places. You're welcome to peruse the stock and see if there's anything that takes your fancy. Come and see me when you're ready to trade. Fish mole. Mushroom kingdom, here we come. <laughs> yeah. Nice boat, get off it. Haha, <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. But, like, most of this gear is super heavy. So I don't offload it at every pontoon. But come aboard and see what equipment you. Oh, she's just scrapping the ship. Cool. Well, good to know that she's here and she does literally everything. Oh. Mm. You might be used to dry docks at other ports, but we can make this, the same upgrades to your boat here at this floating dock. Check it out. Cool. She does everything. Oni, hello! Welcome. We're having a whale of a time. <laughs> I wish I could take this boat. It is way nicer than my boat. Whoa, it's stinking here real bad. Oh. I thought it would do something cool, but instead it just hurt me. How's the ocean treating you? The ocean's a real bee, if I gotta be honest with you. An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles towards you. The ocean starts with an O, actually. Well, I thought it was a C. I, I'm up to your chat room. If I hear any more ocean puns, it's on site. Ah. Oh, uh, greetings. 
don't get many visitors around here. What is it that you need? This place doesn't seem safe. Why do you live here? Me rocking up in my cool boat going, why do you live here? <laughs> Chat room, stop! Damn, Hermit, you live like this? Aye. I've been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told, I've been reconsidering my position lately. I have been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life. Until the collapse. Now I'm alone. And cut off by the land and the sea. Left only with these trembling rocks on all sides. I could help you move to Ingfeld. Oh, sorry, sorry to hear that, bro. That's so sad. Anyways, gotta go fish. Adios. It's not that simple. My brother would never, you see. I used to live in Ingfeld with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot. Mostly about how our parents' inheritance would should be divided. We were in the prime of foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest. I stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Where is it? That's where the problem lies. After the collapse, that creature, it dragged debris from the houses down into its wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. It's a lost cause, I know. But if you were to find it, it's a large whalebone crest. It would mean the world to me. My hands are tied. <laughs> That was a really good one. Can you ban that guy? <laughs> we're all we're all silly guys here. Don't don't worry about it. Myself included. I'll look for it. Uh, don't get your hopes up, old man. You're probably gonna die before I find it. Oh, that thing? I sold it to some guy. For 50 bucks. Oh, oh, you mean that? That whale bone crest? Oops. Oops. Thank you. But please be careful. And research. I don't need to rest. Let's check out the other duck. Although, although there is a shipwreck there, I, I can't get past all those rocks though. How do I get in there? A pile of loose debris. Clearing this would make some. Would take some strong explosives. Oh. See, chat? There's very little that a good application of dynamite can't solve. New fish just dropped? Honey, wake up. A uh, new, new game just dropped? Stonefish. New mechanic? A gelatinous stone fish. Fish mole. I can't handle all these stone fish. Put this one here. My pockets are so full of fish. I must have a really small cargo to only be able to fit like three fish and some fishing rods. 
Yeah, let's see. We can sell it to that lady. Oh god, it's nighttime. I'm going to go crazy. I guess I should dock and just pass the time until morning. They let a fish get stoned? The, the fish must have asked for the double pizza. <laughs> Big hat? Frick. I need a fishing hat. I have been fishing hatless. Let's see, what do we have here? This one's a classic. My chat. It, yeah, it's kind of a whole vibe. Here's Ingfell. Looks like one of the residents wants to talk to us. Here I am, just offering my services. You need help with anything? Lady in a blue dress with a funny dog? I love that dog's face. Oh, we've seen this one a ton. This isn't a new hat, don't worry. I, I use this one actually a lot. So it's funny that you don't remember it. It's one of my favorites. Fishing Wednesday? No women allowed? <laughs> Alright. Adios, chat. I've been trying to prepare a special meal for my partner, but I've been having some issues. Around here, we consider aged conger eels to be a particular delicacy. Or is it conjurer? Like conjurer? You may say they're rotting, but they're delicious if prepared correctly. Normally, we bury them in the ground and allow them to mature. But our dog keeps digging them up and eating them. Silly dog. It just... Lady, lady, I can solve your problem for you. Stop burying them in your yard. Just go like... Go bury them somewhere else. I don't know. Away from the dog. I can't raise the subject without spoiling the surprise. Can you bring me an aged conger eel? Conga eel? <laughs> yeah, sure. I will bring you an aged eel. Thank you. You'll be decently compensated. So, if I keep the eel on board long enough, you think that will do it? Usually when the fish rots, it just turns into like a gelatinous pile. I don't think that, that what, that's what she means by aged. Fish can fix me. Women want to make me worse. That's right. That's right. Women want to fix me. But guess what? I ain't broken. <laughs> Imagine going through all the dialogue and not taking the quest. That'd be so funny. We're gonna catch one. Ah, yes, they can be tricky to find. I'm told that they inhabit the holes and burrows within the cliffs themselves. I imagine they've been fished out around the edges, so you may have to venture into the passageways of the cliffs to find them. Okay, that's horrifying. Oh, and did I mention that they only come out at night? Yes, I believe they hide during the day. Good luck. Ooh, this better be worth it. This better be a handsome reward. Is the aging process for fish really that fast? 
In this game, um, two days, they turn to mush. They turn to mushy mush. You want an answer for this quest? Um... Let me get the eel first. But... It might tell me when I get the eel what to do. Yum, fish mush. Hmm. That is just what... That is just what canned tuna is. It is just fish mush. And I go crazy for that. Yeah, they're fermenting. It sounds like a fermentation process. I... That just reminded me about just how much I love kimchi. Wish I could turn into mush in two days without breathing any oxygen. I'll turn you into mush. I'll, I'll turn you into mush. Hey, chat. Hey, chat, guess what? You're pretty cute. Teehee. <laughs> <laughs> Adios. Actually, I will rest here until morning. Or will I? Perhaps I won't. Perhaps. Perhaps I will explore the cliffs and look for that eel. Yeah, fermented fish is a dish for for Icelandic people, I believe. I believe. At least I remember there was like um it might have been whale actually. It might have been like a rotting version of whale. But what is a whale except a like a big fish with with a lot of feelings and they're adorable? You're also cute when you aren't scary, Chibler. Oh, thanks, chat. And I'm never scary. It's gonna ask us for money. I... 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 But... You got any, chat? You got any money on you? You got any money for me? You got any... You got... <laughs> Is that hat merch? I wish. <laughs> I just found this online. You can probably actually buy it online. <laughs> yeah, nothing Eldritch here. Did someone say money? <laughs> arf, 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 did someone say money? Sorry, my heart was not in that bark. That bark doesn't represent me. Time to get close to the cliffs at night and hopefully not crash my little ship here. Wait, wait, wait. Where's my light? Okay. This way? Keep your eyes peeled for rocks. This is- whoop! This is definitely not an eel. A blackmouth salmon. Ooh, I like salmon. This is a nice shape too. That's a nice shape we can take with us. We can just move these around. <laughs> I don't think I can get any more space though. I don't think I can fit any more. <laughs> Some of the sounds are borked. The plop is just really quiet. Like, there's no way to change it. It's already cranked to maximum. It's there, it's just for whatever reason kind of a bit quiet. <gasps> hello, hello, welcome. Yeah, yeah, honk it up. Okay, let's make our way into this old crevasse. Are you an eel? Actually, they're probably gonna be deeper. Are you an eel? No, it's morning. You're not an eel. Oh. <laughs> Are 
Are you an eel? You don't have the right equipment. That's not an eel. You call that an eel? This. This is not an eel either. Okay, what's that horrifying noise? <laughs> I was about to say, it's right behind me, isn't it? And then it appeared. Okay, adios. I'm leaving. This fish is trying to eat my ass. Get out. <laughs> I was just joking around. I was just... I didn't think it was an actual fish. Okay, that was a bit scary and also it really hurt my ship. Jeez Louise, that fish owes me a hundred bucks. <laughs> they call me Ishmael. Asked a question, got the answer. I did. <laughs> Comedic timing. <laughs> what if that fish just wants to have a beer? It wouldn't have tried to destroy my boat. That's not a chill fish. Fishing Tales issue 13, a fish that tried to eat my ass. I know, we can't let that fish get away with it. Let's sell what we got. I'm gonna kill that fish. I'm gonna... It was big, but my boat's bigger. I bet I could run it over. I... I bet I could just run it up, or I should maybe, I should maybe leave. Go back home. I'm not a coward, I'm going deeper. I've changed my mind. No stupid little fish is gonna best me. It wasn't even that big. I hate this game. Ooh, a research part. Okay, we can't get in there without dynamite. So we'll have to go this way. Become the fish. Do you even have weapons? The only weapon I have is this gun show right here. Pow, pow. I don't need weapons. I'm a peaceful creature, chat. We're gonna solve this by talking to it. <laughs> okay, maybe we can't just like talk to it. My poor hull! Jesus! Your ship is dashed into pieces. You slip beneath the surface and join the uncountable souls lost in the depths. I can't. <sighs> so, if we go in there, a big fish will eat my ass. Do you think we can go around, chat? You think we can just try going around? I want to get to that X that marks the spot. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go around. <laughs> In a... On a closer inspection chat, yeah, that fish was bigger than my boat, perhaps, but only barely. It wasn't that much bigger. Don't call this the saga of Chia and the fish that tried to eat her ass, please, chat! That's not a good saga name. That doesn't sound like a cool nautical story. That sounds just like someone's erotic fan fiction. But it's accurate. Okay, it only happened once. Twice. It only happened twice.
Which isn't a lot, but I guess for a fish, it's kind of, kind of weird. I do need these planks. There was a place to get the upgrade gear that I lost when I died to the fish. Oh, I need this too. There's so much I need. I can help the lady set up a new building if I get two of these. I can't. <laughs> I hate inventory Tetris. Okay, here we go. This really is dredge. Yeah, now we're dredging. Now we're talking. Guess what, you stupid little fish? I win. You know why I win? I'm not engaging. Okay, two planks, two metal scraps. It is freaking dark here. Okay, let's go back. Wait, what was that? That's a weird ominous fog over there. I don't think I will go that way. I think I'm just gonna go and sleep. That's the moon? That ain't the moon, Chet. I don't know what kind of moons you're looking at, but that ain't it. I'm not scared. I wouldn't be scared of the moon. I've seen the moon a thousand times. Get closer. I'm going crazy. I will not get closer. Okay, that's a little ominous. Let's just... Let's just stop. And when we wake up in the morning, everything will be fine. <laughs> Okay. Research. What, what's my storage? I'm just gonna put the research part there for now. Trinket as well. The voices, the voices, the, vo the fog is coming, the fog is coming. I think you should go further out to sea, bro. Chat, I don't need sirens to lure me out to sea because I have you. You guys are just... You're trying to get my ass eaten by a giant fish again, aren't you? I'm a siren? You guys are, are sweet, sweet sirens, and I will not listen to your beautiful voices. <laughs> it's probably really cool and interesting. Well, I hate cool and interesting things. I love boring things like waking up in the morning and going fishing and doing nothing else. I'm not going back out. Additional fish hat just dropped. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't tell me, Arky. Okay, I thought you were gonna send me a fish ate my ass hat, and I was about to get really angry. This one's so good. Honey, wake up! New fishing hats just dropped courtesy of Archibald the Bear. I do love your naming convention of just Foish Hat. One and two. Okay. Add those. New fish merch. You're gonna love this, chat. You're gonna love this. This is my new favorite fishing hat. Wait, no. That was one of them?
This is the other. Great hat. Yeah, yeah. S tier hat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Erky. I think it would be funny if Gia had a model that was facing backwards. <laughs> I'm gonna ask Lexi to just make a version of me, like, turn the other way. Doesn't even have to be, like, high fidelity. Just, it would be funny. I, re I love that idea as well. Just facing backwards. Oh, oh, hi, chat. I didn't see you there. <laughs> you aren't alone. The fog is full of friends. Chat, stop. I'm not going out into the ocean by myself right now. I'm just sleeping. Merchant, wait. Merchant wants oh. to talk to me? Hey again, comfort chat. Do you need help with anything? <laughs> Assistance from an angler? Absolutely. I've been trying to collect records of where each species of fish is located. I've figured... i figured out most of them on my travels so far, but there are a few I haven't been able to track down. Reckon you could share, sir. Sir, you should... Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's, it's the ocean. The ocean was starting to speak to me. And through me. I went ocean speak for a moment. You know when you hold a shell up to your ear? And it whispers sweet nothings. Sure, I can help. Great! The fish I have left to track down are oarfish, gulper, eel, goliath, tigerfish, and... Polican? I remember that one has a funny, uh, pronunciation. See, it's coelacanth, isn't it? Yeah, 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 something like coela. I'm looking it up. Colacanth pronunciation. It is coelacanth. Coelacanth. There it is. It's, it's just coelacanth. Coelacanth. I know a little about each species already, so maybe I can point you in the right direction. Mm. I already know where to find gulper eels. They're in my chat room right now. Hey guys, new outfit drop turns around. <laughs> <laughs> uh, speaking of fish eating ass. Anyways, uh, tell me about the oarfish. Given that the oarfish is a long and fragile body, I suspect they'll live in reasonably, reasonably deep but calm water. Maybe the shelter of gale cliffs would suit them. Have you guys seen that video of an oarfish that like? came up from the deep, deep ocean and was, like, floating around in Florida. They're scary fish. Like, they, they... Deep sea fish just don't look... right. They just don't look... That, that, you just look at it and you go, that ain't right. That ain't wholesome. You gotta look this up? I can, I can find you the video. Sela can't. Up, up, up. Yeah, here it is. It, it wasn't Florida. It was filmed in Mexico. See, I can't.
While kayaking in Mexico on a trip organized by Uncruz Adventures, guests were treated Look at with that the rare opportunity creature. to witness not one but two live oarfish. Two! Each greater than 12 feet, they were discovered swimming about in a shallow lagoon. Which is Why very unusual for them. these venture out from deeper waters is unknown, but when they do, it tends to end poorly. Like, imagine, you, you've gone to Mexico for a nice little vacation. You're splashing around in the shallows and something brushes up against your leg. You look down and you see it that is creature. and strong currents may play a role in some of these events. And yeah, despite just everyone's a giant best eel. efforts to guide them away, the two fish look inevitably Look how big stranded. they are. Witnessing these mythical leviathans firsthand is a like once it, in a cool. lifetime opportunity. Don't get it twisted, and but they're freaky. Only on a handful of occasions have they ever been filmed in their natural environment. With so little known about their ecology, each encounter is a chance to learn a little more. To read what the expedition wouldn't they be has bothered by the low pressure? They probably were. That's the whole mystery: is no one knows why they were just like swimming around in the shallows. Yeah, it's just a big eel, essentially. A big, funny-looking eel, and eels are already funny-looking. Imagine one of those in an aquarium. It's probably really hard to get, like, the right pressure and environment for such a deep-sea creature. Hanging out on the beach and you see a freaking prehistoric creature? Yeah, exactly, so true. Say about their experience, check out their blog post in the description below. Once again, thanks for tuning in. Thank you, very informative. Anyways, that's that's an oarfish right there. They're real. They seem like um gentle fish. Thank you, Chia teacher. You're welcome. I remember seeing one of those videos like a long time ago. It was in the news. The oarfish is real. It's real, Chad. It's real, and they won't hurt you because they seem pretty gentle. If you let it acclimate, it can actually survive. Interesting. I guess we don't really, like, we don't know a lot about them. There's a sudden depressurization that kills fish. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, I mean, you do that to a person. It's, if you suddenly are depressurized, chat, like, you get jettisoned into the zero gravity of space, your skin will just fall off your bones. <laughs> yeah it does not in fact end like guardians of the galaxy where you just get kind of frozen and bloated no 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 your skin's gonna fall off you're gonna you're going to freeze and yeah your eyes will will boil those are the first to pop in in no pressure I don't think humans really register on their things to deal with. Yeah, I don't think so either. I don't think oarfish really think about us. In fact, I don't think they really think about anything. <laughs> Have you sauced a video about it? About what happens when you send a person to space? Yeah, yeah, you did, didn't he? Hey! Vsauce, Michael here. Nothing to do with vineyard vine sauce. A different kind of Vsauce. I was also, when I was younger, I was confused about, like, the relationship of Vsauce to Vinny. I, I was like, how does Vsauce relate with Vinny? It seems like cool science shit versus, like, this scrimblo internet creature that we know is Vindy. V Vinny. Vinny. <laughs> Vineyard sauce, if he was smart. <laughs> Be sauce, Michael here. What if we sent you into space right now? <laughs> Be sauce, Michael here. You won't want to miss out on this. You mean this? Yeah, you underline this? This? You mean this? This? Tell me about chat, the gulper eels. I know that gulper eels live in the deepest depths imaginable. You'll have to get some specialist gear to catch one of those. Oh god, of course they do. 
These guys are legitimately scary. They hunt in murky, swampy waters, using the shade of trees as cover. Ew. Actually, I have no idea about coelacanths. But they have a primordial feel to them, don't you think? Okay, thanks. Really, really helpful. Hmm. <sighs> I just want to fish. I don't want to be hunting for prehistoric creatures. What if death is just a respawn opportunity? Yeah. But like if it works like video games of which you are trying to apply chat, then it only sets you back. Fish the ocean dry. I will single-handedly devastate the ecology of the ocean. And guess what? I'll do it without even using plastic straws. <laughs> With one simple trick, scientists hate her. Yeah, Hilo, you said that right. I am the most say so wholesome streamer and a very comfortable comfort streamer. That's why you're all here to get comfortable and be, and be comforted. Uh, by me! What if I'm a speedrunner? <laughs> well, maybe choose a different game to speedrun chat. I don't know. I'm, I'm not your mom, but like, I do know. There are different, better things to speedrun. Comfort. That was a comfort burp. I was just feeling so comfortable. So do we get sea shanties with the nautical Captain Chia? M maybe. Maybe. I, I'm not gonna spoil anything. I said I wouldn't ever talk about it until I had something to show. And guess what? You can't even get a single peep out of me about it. I know nothing. I'll say nothing. My lips are sealed. Loose lips sink ships. And I'm not gonna sink my ship. Alright. Chat, you ready to get your booty ate by a fish again? I'm throwing you in overboard first. I just gotta outswim you. Da -dum. Da -dum. Wait. I think he's right behind me. Okay, we just dredge as fast as we can and then we get out of here before this fish comes to eat me. Okay, I got the I got the crest. I got the crest. We don't need one of we just need two planks, two metal bits, and we got the crest. See that wasn't so difficult, was it? Just a quick in and out job. Oh my god, there's so many shipwrecks around here. I just want upgrade parts. That's the only reason I'm dredging right now. Knowing I can get upgrade parts. I'm- Stand back, Jet! Stand back! I'm dredging! I'm gonna dredge all over the place. Ooh, treasure. Okay. We head back. That's horrifying that it changes color when I, whoop, when I flash my light. That's horrifying. Let's, um, let's just head back. I'm not gonna go over there. No chat. No, my light! 
It went out so fast. The fog, the fog, the fog, the fog. You think I can navigate this? I'm gonna have to. Okay. Look at that. I'm so good at navigating blind at night without seeing. Look at- did you see me finesse that rock dodge? Holy moly, they should give me a reward for that one. Best captain. The fog is coming, the fog is coming. <laughs> yeah, nighttime is scary again. I feel like this part of the ocean is like, I'm going crazy faster. Right? Like, it feels like that? It feels like I'm going crazy faster here. And like, my light's going up faster too. I don't know if it's just my perception of it, or if it's actually happening that way. Or maybe I'm just more, like, just more freaked out by it. Think of the fishing spot and the rare fish. Waiting? I'm not listening to your sweet, sweet siren calls chat. I'm not- I'm not- I'm not going off into the ocean at night yet. Not until I get proper lights. Yeah, I know boosting makes you go crazy as well. Uh, and I am boosting a little bit more, but I didn't boost there. Not one little bit. No need for the light, it just slows you down. <laughs> Jai, I feel like you're trying to like persuade me to do all the wrong things that get me, get me crazified. Do you want me to go crazy? You want me to lose my mind? <laughs> and very bad, hello. It's fine, the fish are asleep at night, smile. Oh yeah? If the fish are asleep at night, then explain, how come I can catch eels? Is, uh, is this your family crest? <laughs> you found it. I never thought I'd see this beauty again. But now... I have a further favor to ask. Would you take this to my brother at Ingfell? Tell him. Tell him his brother is sorry. I would like to come home. That's freaking sad. Ah. Hello again. Um, what do you... What do you know? Or do, do you know how I could clear the debris? Do you know where I can get ah. some dynamite or something? Hey. You'd probably need some explosives to shift those rocks. My brother at Ingfell used to make explosives. <gasps> Chat, we're unlocking explosives. For the whaling operations, you see. Nasty stuff. But with the whales all gone, I can't imagine he's still in business. Nice. Okay, let's rest until morning and then we go talk to brother in Ingfell. Dang, 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 dang. Whoa, ho, ho. nice try. I'm not falling for that one again. Blast some fishes. We're gonna dynamite ourselves up a meal. Yeah, the fish won't know what hit him. Can she even see with that cap on? I don't need to see. I can smell the fish. I have a really good nose. Yeah! You know what would have sold Mo Moby Dick if they just bombed the stupid whale? They should have just threw some dynamite at him. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> they call me Ishmael. What is it? I believe this crest is yours. This guy looks like how I imagine Ishmael from Moby Dick to look like. That's just rude. Is it rude to bomb a whale, chat? What do you think? I'd love to hear your thoughts. <laughs> Gods, I haven't seen this since... <laughs> so he did take it. I knew it. Your brother's sorry. Will you let him come home? He's in real trouble over there. Your brother needs to move back here. He's sorry, he's sorry. 
Hmm. I don't know if I was in the right state when he left. <sighs> okay, fine. You can stay in my old workshop. At least for the time being. But I'll need some time to clear it out. While I'm doing that, perhaps you can do something for me. See, I've been trying to clear some debris in the pathways through the cliffs to make a shortcut with explosives. I was able to set a charge, but the cliffs seemed particularly unsteady that day, so I didn't risk detonating it. Sorry, sorry, the fish is fighting back. The fish, the fish is fighting! Hitting! Ah, I lost it. You just need to get in there and set it off. It's not far in. I left some yellow flags nearby. You can't miss it. Moby Dick what happened in the 1850s. Dynamite was invented in the 1867. Well, guess what? It's a freaking book. Why didn't he set it in 1867 and then bomb the stupid whale? <laughs> If the whales minded, they would complain. I think they're, that the whale song is complaining. I thought you were clapping right there, Chia. Why would I clap? Nothing is happening. You are authorized for Operation Moby Dick Explosion. I don't like that name, chat. Can we change it? Chia would, rewrite, re Chia would rewrite history only to bum something up and make it floor accurate. Yeah, it would be cooler. Look me in the eye, chat, and say that if they bummed Moby Dick. Look me in the eye and say that if they bummed him, it would be lamer. Because that's simply a lie, it would be cooler. So, we go set off the explosives? Right, a bit, a bit scary, especially since there's a big fish swimming around in there. As soon as I go in, that fish is all over me. It'd be way cooler. Yeah, it'd be red. Oh yeah, if they if they sent in some really muscular guy to beat the whale up too, that'd be cool. Like if they boxed. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, Splagoon. That's my favorite part. That is true, chat. Whales have- they are known to, like, fill with gas when they are deceased and then explode. They are- they are known for that. Okay, in we go! <laughs> I never read the Moby Dick. What do you mean? Homoerotic tension between Ishmael and the whale. <laughs> can can we have someone smarter than I confirm? Set it off, set it off. A pile of loose debris. Okay, just set it off. There's a fish trying to eat me. You, you light the fuse. Boom. Okay, okay, get out of here. Before he comes back for round two. Okay. Stupid fish. Stupid big fish. Damaging my hull. Oh shit, I hear him. He makes the ocean vibrate. This is a tough breeze. There we go. Gotta stop and do some dredging. It's in the title of the game, and if I don't do it, then I'm breaking contract. I legally have to dredge X amount per stream. Otherwise, they, they take away my dredging rights.
I'm really just looking for upgrades. A little book club happening in chat. Well, it is suddenly very dark. Good thing the dock is right here. Let's rest just a little. Oh, I can also start a new book to read because this one's complete. I don't know what reading does. Probably just like, probably nothing important. That's interesting, Bing Bong. See, I don't even need to read Moby Dick. I have, I have people. I have, I have people for that chat. I have people to explain things for me. I got people for that. I don't even need to read. <laughs> it's a fun book, though. Well, I have people to read Moby Dick and have fun reading it for me. I'm not selfish, so, like, if you want, chat, you can have all the fun by reading Moby Dick. I don't need to. I couldn't keep it all for myself. Uh. New fish just dropped. Nice trophy fish. This fish is too normal. That's what we're talking about. Big bug eyed freak here. Looking at me with those goofy uh uh eyes. The fish stare, fish mole stare. <laughs> That's a great description of Moby Dick. It's a saucy wild time. Call me Ishmael. I, I opened up Moby Dick. I read Call Me Ishmael. And I was like, that's so cool. That's raw. That's sick. That's Kino. And then I closed the book immediately because I was like, it's peaked. In reality, I was like, this is going to be too raw for me to read right now. And I don't have the time <laughs> to, to like take it all in. I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking. It did not peak at the first page. It's just, I, it was so raw, I just had to put it down and absorb that. And I haven't picked it up since. She is recording Moby Dick's audiobook, but keeps inserting her opinion along the way. <laughs> that sounds like such an annoying audiobook. Why would you listen to that? Call me Ishmael. Oh yeah, yeah, that's so raw. You know what? You know what, chat room? We're just gonna stop reading here for a few decades so that we can just take in that line. Um, I will release the second part of the audiobook at a later date. Alright, thank you for listening. <laughs> audiobook plus commentary track? I will try to sound- uh, I will try to sound like William Defoe the whole time. Tell me you're fond of me lobster. I've seen it in your eyes. 
<laughs> yeah, that sounds amazing. All right, next uh, next subathon. That'll be a goal. Moby Dick audiobook. That sounds like a huge undertaking, but like it sounds like a fun one. I am the type of person crazy enough to just record that. <laughs> audiobook is just you're reading the first three words over and over going, damn, damn. <laughs> raw, Kino, goat, goat, raw, raw, goat. 50 minute analysis on whether this was a Metal Gear reference. I ha having no knowledge of Metal Gear or barely any. <laughs> that is a massive undertaking. Okay, we'll do it at like a billion subs then. But I would just know that I would. Just know that I'd be willing. If I had the time. All the Moby Dick fans sniping and going, well, actually. <laughs> You've done it. We heard the blast from here. Gods, the echo. I'm surprised the cliffs didn't come down on your head. I've got things ready. Go and tell my brother. You can come home. Me just, like, stumbling over words because I'm freaking dyslexic. As well. I'm, I'm joking, I'm joking. I cut those parts up, but just just know. Just know that I'd probably be, like, struggling with half the book. Whenever the teacher was like, who would like to read this out loud? And then, like, pointing at me and me shaking and crying and shitting and, and pissing everywhere because I had to read out loud to the class. But it was so satisfying when you did, like, nail a paragraph. Halfway through, she is going to make her own alternative Moby Dick universe and talk from Moby Dick's perspective. <laughs> There's this whaler. They call him Ishmael. He's so obsessed with me. Why is he so obsessed with me? Oh my god, the sea captain is just so obsessed with me. <laughs> and then we could have a whale no noises like counterpart audiobook which is Moby Dick's perspective <laughs> when's the Chia cinematic universe dropping well, when, when Captain Chia comes out, that's the first part of the cinematic universe. That's the first character in the Chiaverse that isn't default Chia. That'd be Oscar worthy. I'd put on the performance of a lifetime just for you, chat. Put my heart and soul into it. <laughs> I know, the whale just wanted to be left alone. The captain was so obsessed with him. Dude, just leave me alone. <laughs> Why are you so obsessed with me? <laughs> His perspective only? They gotta do human voices? Like, how they do? Yeah. With IRA representatives on the news? Human voice. Or like, just cartoon animals. But like you pan out and the dog is just going arf, 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 arf. and then you pan into the dog's face and the dog is like this is my life up until this point i've lived a very interesting life but now now i am dying we zoom out again arf, 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 arf. <laughs> that's what humans think animals talk like i've got things ready what were we doing we're blowing shit up Oh my god, here's my audiobook about Moby Dick, but like, halfway through, this is what would have happened if they just blew up the whale. <laughs> this is what would have happened if they invented dynamite and then blew up Moby Dick. <laughs> 
Go and tell my brother he can come home. I've got good news. Sponge boy me Bob, you can come home. Thunk, thunk. I thought I was just gonna crash right into the dock. Sometimes the intrusive thoughts, they, they, they win. Sometimes they win. Sometimes you do just crash yourself into a dock. Ah. Hello again. What can I do for you? Your brother forgives you. He found you a place to stay. <laughs> I will now make Moby Dick 27 pages long instead of 378. <laughs> he does? That's a huge weight off my chest. One so old. I hardly remembered it was there. Right. Well, I'm packed and ready to go. Oh, 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 okay. Um. Um, I gotta, I gotta go get some space. I can return for this item later. I, I will return for you, old man. I'm sorry. Not enough space. Not enough space. I wasn't expecting you to just try and hop on my ship. <laughs> you have obtained a brother. I could just take him with me on a little adventure. What if I just take him with me? Now crash your ship. <laughs> okay. You can have these poish. Is that enough room for brother? I don't think so. Let's deposit some junk in our storage. Let's put these away for now. Just clear it all out. I'm just doing errands between all these islands. Isn't there like a ferry? there anyone else who could just take them? It, it's like two feet. My brother and fish. You're taking up so much inventory space. <laughs> yeah, what if I just drop the hermit into the ocean? I've come to pick you up. Drop. I'm putting him in upside down. The hermit climbs aboard with all his belongings. I'm gonna make this as uncomfortable as possible. Oh, oh, whoop. Sorry, I have a hard time controlling this, this ship. Oh, strong winds today. What do you mean? It's, it's calm. It's calm, clear waters. Yup, yup. Oh, is that a, is that a rogue wave coming for me? Me, me. Oh, oh, gotta swerve to by this rock. Whoa. Deja vu. Da -da 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 all right, we're here. Well, whale, whale, whale. Here we are. The hermit notices the old whaler standing on the dock, waiting for him. Huh. Little brother, you're home. I, I'm so sorry. I was so foolish. We both were. Come inside. Let me get your bags. The two brothers walk away down the dock. One of them pauses for a moment, then turns back to you. Oh, stranger, if you find any more debris that needs a clearing, I'm working on making some more backed explosives. Moby Dick, if it was cool and they blew up the whale, let's go! This is why he's retired. Come by the old whaling yards, anytime. Yeah, I'm here for the explosives. Oh, <laughs> Ooh. I 
hope you can put them to good use wherever you find cause for it. Oh my god! I only need a- well, I should take- I should maybe take a couple, right? That, what if we need some explosives along the way? I could take a couple more. All full of explosives? What can go wrong? I could, um... I could count the number of times on both hands that I accidentally blew up my own ship in Sea of Thieves by just leaving explosives in the hull. A pile of loose debris. It could be cleared to make a shortcut. Boom, baby! The debris crumbles away. Government mandated dredging time? Well, 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 what do we have here? A relic. Nice. We can take this to the collector and this is just what he wanted. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, I'm gonna take some fish to sell to the lady. Then we'll spend the night, and then we'll take this to the collector and we'll head back. They're probably wondering where I went at the little town I set up shop. They're like, wow, she really did just go off into the ocean and never come back. You think she's dead? Oh yeah, most certainly she is deceased. A whale probably ate her. Although... She was so tiny, perhaps even just a pretty large macro could have gotten to her. I just caught that fish for no reason. Just pricked that fish in particular. Your ship is so damaged it's killing me? Yeah, do I look like I care? <laughs> That's money. Yeah, I brought you some fish. And we can spend the night here. What are you even talking about, streamer? I don't know. I got lost in the sauce for a moment. What was I talking about? This game makes me want to see Chia do a Sunless Seas run even more. Well, maybe. I already played a ton of Sunless Seas, though. Pull over that ass too fat. Beep beep. Alright chat, thanks. I don't know why I read that. <laughs> the sun, the sun, the sun, the sun, the sun. Tier 2 hull upgrade. Upgrades your vessel to a tier 2 hull and adds 5 new cargo spaces! I need that. We gotta start dredging up as much material as possible. We need four planks, two boats, three bolts of cloth, and something that I have not obtained yet. Some sort of sparkly... I don't know, shiny metal of some sort? Hmm. What do you mean so damaged? Sun Seas is pretty good, definitely. It loses something once you know it. Yeah, once you know what happens. It's like a storybook. It's one of those games where you play it once and you go, wow, that was amazing. But then it's hard to play again. Like Outer Wilds, once you know all the secrets, it's like... It, it can't shock you anymore. You could just pretend Chia is... A seasoned sailor since she is basically a pirate already. Yeah, just squint your eyes, pretend we're playing Sunless Seas. 
We got sunless seas at home, and this is it. The kind of game that the first playthrough is just magnificent. Yeah, like Outer Wilds. I already played Outer Wilds, so like I I can't I can't stream that. I already played it. That's one of those you can only play it once sort of games. Outer Wilds is still fun to sightsee through now and again. Yeah, yeah, there's still like little things. Reasons to go back. And there's a new DLC I haven't even played or touched or know anything about, but like. It was so. Outer Wilds was so. Like. I don't know if I will play the DLC. Like I don't I don't know at this point. Maybe maybe if I forget more about Outer Wilds and that will happen because I have a very poor memory. So eventually I'll get to the point where I go Outer Wilds, what's that? Have I played that before? No. Yeah, the mystery. Sometimes a good game is just a just solving a good mystery. Just a nice mystery for you to crack wide open. But once that mystery is cracked wide open, you can't uncrack it. Maybe if I develop dementia, I can enjoy Outer Wilds again. <laughs> Drew! Drew, look on the bright side, chat! If you ever develop dementia, you can play all your favorite video games again. That's, that's, that's a good point of that. Of a very sad thing to have happen to you. But at least you get to play Outer Wilds again for the first time. Me picking up the controller, forgetting how to even use it. <laughs> this video game. I forgot. No, no one here is spoiling Outer Wilds, don't worry. We're just talking about how fantastic it was. Nothing wrong with saying that something is good. Me picking up the controller, forgetting I forgore. I forgore. That's why I love the old person simulator on Roblox. Sh shut up. <laughs> It is a special game. If you haven't played Outer Wilds, ev everyone in this chat room and you were even just like thinking about it, you want a nice mystery and a nice world to explore, I highly recommend it. Don't- don't have anyone like- you don't have to play with anyone just if you've got some free time on a weekend to really immerse yourself into it. I highly recommend that you do. It's- it's- it's good. It's immersive. It's special. There's there's something very special about it. Has someone spoiled Outer Wilds and they'd be banned? Yeah, they would be banned on the spot, don't you worry. We take game spoilers very seriously. More seriously than anything. You won't just be banned. I, I will find where you live. And I will punch you in Minecraft. Chat yearns for the mines. I'll put you to work. Okay, let's on dock and take this to the collector. Which one's the collector? Blackstone Isle? Gia will fucking kill you if you spoil Outer Wilds. I will. I will find you. I will just- if you- as soon as the spoiler leaves your mouth, I'm teleporting behind you. SCP Peanut style. And it's all over for you, punk. Need some new reading material. Hola! <laughs> hey, 
hamsters yearn for the mines. I yearn to fish right now. I think there is some dredging to be done around here. Maybe not. Maybe? What's that speckling? Ugh! You approach a hooded figure. Swapped in dark blue robes, their faces barely visible. Fisherman, please, help. You can barely hear the rasping whisper above the wind and waves. Fulfill the hunger. The hooded figure unfurls an old paper scroll. They point to a shape shown at the top. It appears to be a blue mackerel. Um... Okay, sure, I'll get you a fish. Chat, I'm getting some weird vibes from this guy. Are you are you getting that too? Let's place a marker here. I'm gonna put a big ol' um, question mark. <laughs> so we don't forget where he is. Seems nice. Well, he didn't attack us on sight, so that's good. I trust them entirely? Chat, you are too trusting. Me when I haven't eaten for three hours. Find me the dandies. I hunger. That's not a mackerel. Mackerel, mackerel, mackerel. I hope I don't have to go too far for these. They usually stay near the coast. Mackerel! Whee! Give a man a fish, feed him for a day. <laughs> Give a man a fish so he won't eat me. I hope I'm not next on the menu. You to do just wear tattered robes and speak in a raspy whisper while petitioning strangers for fish? Yeah, you're right, Chad. I am being a bit judgmental. I apologize. With expert precision, they plunge their hands through the gullet of the fish and tear out the heart. They stuff it into their mouth unceremoniously. Yeah, chat, what was that about this guy being perfectly normal? And trustworthy? More. Still empty. They point to another shape on the scroll. This one looks like a tiger mackerel. I don't think we've caught one of those. Sorry, chat, what, what was that? What, 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 what did you want to say to me again? That guy is perfectly normal and trustworthy? Yeah, yeah, I think so too. Don't tell me you've never done that. I have never done that, chat. I've never- I don't even think I could do that. I don't even know where the fish's heart is. That guy can be trusted with a fish. I am normal and can be trusted with fish hearts. This is a stupid little cod. Just, I'm gonna go to every fishing spot, see if we can get a tiger mackerel. Maybe this is a regular mackerel. The heart, you, it's not, it's not the tastiest part of the fish. Do fish even have, <laughs> do they even have hearts? I've never seen it. I've only ever seen a fish fillet. I, when I lived in Nunavut, I do remember people gutting the arctic char though. Like the blood was almost black. It was, it was scary. I didn't really, I didn't look too closely at what came out of the fish at that point. I didn't want to. I didn't want to end up throwing up. 
Fish are heartless, godless beings. <laughs> no, we did not dissect fish for biology class. We dissected worms, frogs, uh, sheep brain, and cow eyeballs. But at that point, when I was finishing school, the live dissections were getting... Well, not not that the the things we were dissecting were alive anymore, but like the having to do a dissection live in class had been being phased out for computer programming stuff for for doing it in a program, which I think is honestly better. Live dissections, yeah, we were we were doing vivisections. You know, there was. The FBI showed up, there was- there was aliens, it was crazy. I had a crazy school time when I was a kid. Yeah, we really did just dissect aliens. I can get some fish hearts to- to mail if- if you ever open a P.O. box. Yeah, no, I, I don't think I will open a P.O. box just for that reason. I know there's gonna be some freak here that's gonna send me rocks and fish hearts. And I really, I don't want to be responsible for that. 4k subs, Chia will dissect one chatter of her choice. Done. Done. Don't threaten me with a good time. Yeah, dissections are very informative, but you, you can get the same information from the uh, programs they were using. With with none of the smell. Or the viscous slipperiness of an uh, eyeball's vitriol fluid. So, you've returned. I wasn't sure you were coming back. You dragged the massive music box into the room gouging the floorboards beneath it. The collector doesn't seem to mind. He's focused on the box. What's in the box? Chat, what's in the box? You found this at the cliffs, didn't you? Yes. Ah, excellent. This should make future return journeys a little more swift. Allow me. He selects one of the silver ribbons trailing from the crimson-bound book, opening it to some unseen page. Turning to catch the dim light, he whispers the words on the page. After a few seconds, you feel your stomach drop suddenly, as though thrown high by a wave. He closes the book and turns his attention back to you. Now. There are yet more relics to find. Keep looking. The reef at Stellar Basin may have caught and accumulated some wreckage. Search around that area. I'll, I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Nothing. I'll be going now. Adios. Oh, oh, oh. Let's get our planks. I'm just gonna store this dynamite. If I have to store more, I will. But we're gonna grab this stuff so we can help that lady set up shop. I think we're close. Math equation here, how- uh... You know what, I'm gonna clear up more space. There, now we have enough space. We can just take these. <laughs> Let's unduck. So, the Stellar Basin? Whoa, okay, all the way over there. Looks like there's a couple of ports.
I think we're done with the Gale Cliffs for now. I wonder if I can blow up that big fish. Wait, no! I'm a fisherman! My silver ear earrings just... Yeah, I know, they fell overboard. I should have, like, packed them more securely. Anyways, I wonder if I can fish that big fish that tried to eat my ass. Can, can you throw the dynamite like Mario Kart? Yeah. I don't think so. I need to get a hull upgrade. A lighthouse keeper is waiting for you on the dock, looking displeased. Ugh. I saw you were sailing out towards the horizon, crossing that deep expanse. Do you really think that's wise? Problem? It feels a bit like tempting fate, does it not? Things are bad enough around here without your provocations. Abruptly, she walks away. Her eyes scan the water as she walks along the dock. She has a point! <sighs> this guy's got a headache, this dude. Okay, store that. Uh... here. Let's go set up that lady's house, but I'm gonna do that in the morning so I don't go too crazy. Dun, 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 dun. Deja vu. Adios! Too many crabs! You ever just look in your crab pot and go, that's too many crabs, and then you don't take them because it's just an absurd amount of crabs for one person? Jackpot? Yeah, I suppose we did hit the crab jackpot. if I'll have enough space to take a bunch of these. I guess I could come back after I do drop off the initial pieces of wood and bolts. Unless I can just... No, my ship is just not, it's not set up properly. There's, there's too many rods in the way. Too many bits. <laughs> now that I do have dynamite, you think I can just like... Awesome. Mario Kart style? No, I can manifest, but I can't throw dynamite. Weird, but okay. Hmm. Not, not how I would have done it, really. But each their own, I suppose. You delivered all the necessary materials. Yeah, weird. Mm. 
lots of dredging to be done here. Now we're dredging. I really am just hoarding treasure. I don't know when I'm going to see the the trinket fella again. So I just keep popping it into storage and hoarding them. What is this? Oh, cloth. We do need that. We can take this all back and at least get our hull upgraded or start the upgrade just started. Oh. Oh, it's nighttime. I didn't even notice. Okay, let's let's head back. That's not the that's not the way. No, 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 not off into the fog towards the lighthouse. Lighthouse make Chia keep sane. Stop from throwing chat overboard. Streamer, it's dark. Yeah, thanks for the warning. A little too late. I didn't even see the fish with your goofy ah uh, ah uh, hat. You're not the first person to ask that. And I can just sense fish. And I can smell them. Fish are pungent and potent creatures. There is a sparkly there. You see the sparkly? I think I can delicately grab the sparkly. The lighthouse towers above. Wave, waves crash endlessly against the perilous rocks below. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken and thrown at its feet. We ponder the intrinsic power of this structure, a vast column of stone shouldering the responsibility of countless lives. How long will it stand? How long until it decays into ruin, its purpose exhausted? The lighthouse towers above. Okay, that was a cool little piece of world building, but ultimately useless to me. Ski! Uh, is that a fish in your pocket? And you're just happy to see me. Yeah, where we're going, we don't need eyes to see. You've done it? Well, no sense in wasting time. Let's get moved. Oh, okay. Um, you, you're trying to climb aboard my ship too? Oh my god, everyone. Please, please, ladies. There's enough room for everyone. Just let me... No. I want to upgrade. I guess I have to upgrade everything before I can get that. Or maybe I need to complete just one of these upgrades, which I have not done. Here! Engine spaces? Now can I get the hull? Now, now can I start the hull? No? Okay. We just need a lot of wood. One, there's one. The rest of the stuff I can hoard, put it in my storage. Look at all my beautiful, beautiful pieces of junk that I've collected. Bruh, it's nighttime, ladies. Stop, don't say it like that. Oh, you're talking to the lady trying to crawl into my ship at night. She's excited to get going. I thought you were trying to point out it was nighttime, but in a, like a funnier manner than other people. I was like, bro, yeah, it is nighttime. So true. Oh, what's this big shoal of fish? That's eel.
the nighttime crawler. She crawls into your ship hall at night and eats all your fish. You're not supposed to stare into like the light of the lighthouse chat. Bad things happen. So got to get the fish heart guy his tiger mackerel, right? Yes, we do. Ah. We do indeed. I'm not sure where to get tiger mackerel. It might be a nighttime fish. How much do you have to hate a town if you're willing to jump into some random dude's boat in the middle of the night just to get out of there? She hated it a ton. She did indeed. New fart on Discord. Well, I don't care what you do in your free time chat. Can't stare at the lighthouse, can't eat fish hearts, can't have shit and dredge. <laughs> Alright, yeah, no, eat fish hearts and stare into the light of the lighthouse, see what happens. Yes, yes, this'll do. Thank you, fella. I'm not your fella, chum. Give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome back anytime. She reaches into her toolbox. Whoa, 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 whoa. And pulls out a handful of components. Oh, thank you. Nice. I can get a real good upgrade with these bad boys. Look at this. Jet engine. I could also start researching some wild rods. Yeah. I'm so engine build. I kind of just, I want all the engines. That's a fast engine. This is a big engine. I want this engine. Let's do an engine and a rod. That way everyone's happy. There. <laughs> All right, new new fan art just dropped. Always a blessing when this happens while I'm streaming. Yo, this is sick. Yeah. This is power. This is this is powerful art. That's me, fishing up the fish that tried to eat my ass, and this time I'm winning. I'm gonna eat its ass. <laughs> the loathsome ass eater. <laughs> There's this Gia. <laughs> it's very cool, thank you. <laughs> no, like, you always make such really good fishing art. Like, you make great art in general, but, like, your fishing art is so dynamic as well. It's just, like, you got the magic touch. You got the angler's touch. It's all about the fish, baby. It's all about the mets. It's all about the, bet the mets. Good dynamics, is that a word? We do say that in art sometimes. Very expressive. Yeah! I love it. I love it. Thank you. A fish that tried to eat my ass. <laughs> uh, if you color this in, I will totally make this the new dredge thumbnail. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Wait, don't don't quote that. No. English major. Yeah, Bing Mom, maybe you should put in the quote because you're gonna get it right. Put that degree to good use. Yeah, it's very good. Thank you. Thank you. Beautiful. <laughs> Looks just like me. Like, like, 
That's me fishing. My my face when I fish. Beautiful. Okay, let's switch games to the other game I was planning on doing. It's called Cubes. But spelt weird, I will change the category shortly after this break, and by this break I mean I gotta go... I gotta go break something. I got some kneecaps to break. I'll be right back, chat. I'll be back in five minutes. I'll leave this up though, it's, it's so... It's so cool. The game is starting to be cool. Yeah, we're getting into the, like, the guts of this fish, aren't we? We're really getting into the good stuff. The good guts. But that's the thing. We gotta... We gotta space it out. We can't just... Play all the cool stuff in, in one go, right? Then there's no cool stuff later. For, for us when we just want to chill and fish. You're gonna have fun with this game. You're gonna have fun with this other game. And you'll even- you'll forget about Drains. You'll forget that this game even exists. You're gonna have so much fun. I'll be back in five minutes. Adios! chat. Were you spamming fish mole while I was away? Be honest. No? Are you lying to me, chat? You shouldn't lie to a hamster. You, you hear what happens to people if they lie to hamsters? I would never lie. You're right, chat. You would never lie to me. Bunch of, bunch of sweethearts.
loathsome dung eaters. Oh, I'm not- I'm not muted. Um, do I have to go... Oh. Oh, oh, never mind. I had a stupid question that was answered immediately by the menu. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Can you tell I've been petting Winston? Can you tell I pet the cat that I'm allergic to? Ferocious feaster of posteriors. Yeah, I love the sprite for this. I'm gonna have to commission this artist to do like a Captain Chia on a boat or something. For a new loading screen. This is an alpha demo. Well, not a demo, but the game is an alpha. It's called... I'm never gonna spell this right. It's called Cubes. It's an arcade open world sort of game. Minecraft. In real life. Pirate Chia anticipation is palpable? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Who's to say it's even in the works right now? Not me. Not I. Literally Minecraft, a way cooler? Wow. Yeah. I've got no music. Maybe there's just no music playing. Are you getting music? Uh, you're not getting music either. Oh, you want my birth date? Sorry for being nosy. We need to know that to protect the young ones. What year were you born? How old can I be? All right, all right, chat. I'll be honest and truthful. I'll let you see my birth date. All right. That's my birth date for anyone who's asking. This game doesn't want to capture, so I guess I can't show you if it's not going to capture. That's funny. Loathsome. There we go. Okay. Cube World 2. I guess so. Who else fell for Cube World when it first came out? One of, one of the content creators I was watching at the time. Well, I guess we don't need the fishing equipment anymore. One of the content creators I was watching at the time was like playing keyboard with like his his buddies and i was like oh my god i i want in on that action minecraft but better minecraft but awesome little did we know there was no such thing as a better minecraft it it's simply an impossible feat you know why minecraft is already perfect apparently the main dev is coming back to keep world to fix it that game has remained in the same state for the past Almost a decade. She has no birth date. I have no birth date. Um, but if I am to be honest, I was born in 1921. 
awesome December 22nd. December 1921. It seems to be having an issue with this. Dub model. Time result cannot be represented in this installation. Do I need a more realistic birthday? Uh oh. How old is 18 now, chat? Wait, what's going on? We're trying to select a birthday. <laughs> she was not born, she was seven. That's why that game isn't letting me create a birth date. It knows. It knows I was never birthed. 1969? Frick yeah, that's a reasonable birth date. December 22nd. Apparently, no one was born in 1969 on December the 22nd. Time result cannot be represented in this installation. Let's go... What's the... What's the earliest we can do but still not have, like, kid content protected? Yeah, this game is kind of ageist. 18 is 18 now. 2018? No, I don't think the math adds up, Jet. Error. You are too old. <laughs> Just do 2000? Okay. 2000. December. 22nd. So, you were born on December 22nd, 2000, meaning you're 20. Whoa! Two that's 22 now? Crazy how time do that. I thought I was 22, but apparently I'm older than that. I feel like I've been stuck in 22. <laughs> I was born today, smile. Wow, really impressive you can play video games at such a young age. I don't even think I could lift my head when I was, like, born. Yes. You are a guest. Oh. Oh, I'm gonna pick a username. I just don't- I just- I don't want it to show weird information. I'm- oh, I'm always scared of alpha na- or alpha games like this. So. Yeah, that's my name. I got THE Chia. I'm the OG. My name is Chia. Oh my god, I got it. Chad, I got it. No, my character isn't called Bingus. This is the Chia. My face when I can secure just Chia. A very popular name. My ham, you're forever five. <laughs> I'm young at heart. I'm young at heart. Hi, Splagoon. Just came back from meeting. WTF is this? It's Minecraft, but cooler. How do I change my character? I don't want to look like this. Create? Oh. No, oh, that's just me creating objects. Explore. Oh my god, this is Roblox, but like... There's less of it, but Minecraft content. This one's just called Tamagotchi. Super math boy. Pictionary! Oh my god, there's Pictionary. This is the best game ever. Which one do you want to play, Jet? This is Steam Roblox. Among Us? Well, we don't have Among Us, do we? You have more age-related crises more than I do, Chia? Yeah, but... So? I feel like that's more common coming out of the pandemic. Everyone realizing that they spent, like, most of their early adult life just in lockdown. And then going, oh my god, now what? 
Now what do I do? Monster Regulator Ants War Flying Unicorn Chat, you wanna play Flying Unicorn? Oh god, there's Minesweeper. Can I downvote games? Can I blacklist games? This one's just called Ridiculous Chess. I, you know what? I'll be the judge of that. What's so ridiculous about it? Hmm. I guess we'll see. You got Cookie Clicker too? Let's go. Okay. Whoa, chest jump scare. Waiting for another player. Shit, I think I just got conned into actually playing chess. So, um... Yeah... <laughs> wow, this chess is ridiculous. <laughs> I have to wait forever for another player. Can you believe these wait times? I guess we found out what's so ridiculous about it. We might need a single player game because I have no friends. Looks like you got conned into playing this game. I got conned into playing chess. Oh, <gasps> an opponent? Hello. Oops. What's happening? Lights turn? Which one? Which one am I? I assume I'm not the one falling from the earth. Oh, I, I am. I am light. Okay. Whoa, this chest is just redonkulous. <laughs> Why is he falling? <laughs> Infinitely. What's going on? This is ridiculous chat. Uh, chest chat. <laughs> also, my chat is ridiculous. But this is just ridiculous Jess, what do you mean? What's going on? Just a little bit of ridiculousness. Nothing to see here. <laughs> yeah, you can stream snipe. So it's my character that's falling infinitely. Oh, oh, where are you going, buddy? Sinking into the earth. Well, it's it's my turn now. I'm gonna get my knight going. Or maybe I won't. Maybe I'm just gonna keep moving pawns. <laughs> just move pawns around. Oh, this guy. Well, you know what? I'm not gonna tell you what's going on in my head. Chess is a mind game. You can win or lose at the mind game part of it. You fool! Help! <laughs> Buddy, are you okay? You seem to be having some issues. I call this the Frenchman's kiss opening. Oh, we'll see where that gets you. <laughs> this is way better than chess.com. I agree. Oh my god. By Jove. He hasn't done it. Because, wait, is that your queen? Yeah, that's your queen. Well, guess what, punk? I can, um... I don't want to move that one. Yeah, I think a bishop is worth a queen. Or is that a bishop? I can't really tell. They're so blocky. I know which one's the king. 
I know where the pawns are, the rooks, the horses, but the, the queen and the bishops kind of look pretty similar. Wait, that's a bishop. Please, no. <laughs> Well, 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 how the the turns have tabled. You're bad at chess. You're worse than me. <laughs> it's like I'm playing an actual little baby toddler. We'll just move this little goober back. It's kind of ominous how there's no music in the background. Talk shit, get hit, do your best. Genuinely, do your best. I really hope you, you can do better. That wasn't it, though. Is that the queen? No, that's a... That's a bishop, okay. Then it can only move to the side. I'm losing track of the queen. My character just keeps going, oops, 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 oops. King me, king me. Go fish. <laughs> oops, oh, there's a spider on my wall. I'm brave though, and I did not scream as soon as I saw it because I'm so brave. Nice horse, chat. M m Whoa, no, I didn't want to do that. I was just clicking buttons. Trick. My, my pawn. Oh no, don't, please, don't. Don't, no, my pawn is so precious to me. <laughs> what the horse doing? Kind of, uh, am, uh, this is an interesting move. Yeah, how hungry are you, chat? How hungry? That's cheating? Uh, bro, I'm just playing the game. <laughs> you really want to lose your knight? Alright. Be my guest. You've already lost your queen, buddy. It's, it's like... It's Jover. <laughs> Ever see a chess game where every move is a blunder? I love how it gives you infinite time too, so if I just- if I was a piss baby enough, I could just get up and- and leave. I could just be like, nope. I'm hunting down your knight. What are you gonna do about it? Ever see a chess game where every move is a blunder? <laughs> it's impressive. This is like watching two monkeys on a chessboard just try to figure it out. Wow, the other horse is going. Crazy. Oh, th those are my pieces, okay. Well, you don't have your queen, so I might as well just, like, take advantage of it. Wait! Uh-oh. Nobody say a dang thing. You keep your dang mouth shut. No! <laughs> I was hoping he wouldn't notice. <laughs> it's freaking 
I I hate knights. They're such a hard pattern. I'm joking. I love them. Why'd you do that? What voxel bullshit is this? I don't know. <laughs> I guess I'm just playing chess with a chatter right now. So it's called Dredge, you see. Go ahead, make my day. It feels like budget Roblox. We have Roblox at home, chat. I'm gonna put on music, cause this is... This is freaking me out, the silence. Who wants some lo-fi music to play chess to? Some lo-fi beats. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Okay, what what did you what was your move? Probably nothing that important. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's really rude of me. I'm not actually sorry. Don't tell that chatter. Go ahead, King me. <laughs> what are you doing? You're doing some wacky things. I'm into it. <laughs> that horse is dumb. Who's a dumb horse now? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Okay. Well. I'm on the hunt now. I'm out for blood. You silly bozo. You gotta move your king now. Uh, devs, can you balance the game? The horse is too strong. What are you gonna do about it, punk? Can you stop slamming your king up and down, you little piss baby? Just play. Make your move. You've got three of them. suppose I should retreat for now. If I go here, the king's just gonna take me. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Thanks. That's so sweet of you. Yeah, this isn't fair. The chatter is stream sniping. I'm not allowed to stream snipe. <laughs> I 
I don't know why to me that was just the saddest pawn move ever. Herm. Adios. Wow, you're moving the rook out? Crazy. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if it, so if I can get one of my pawns to the other side, guess what? I get a queen back. Gotta make the saddest pawn move ever asked to leave stream. <laughs> Sorry, that move was just so sad. What you gonna do about it? Two idiots play chess. Can we can we title this stream? Two bozos. kind of move is this? <laughs> what are you doing? I've never- this is avant-garde chess. He's playing 5D chess. I don't even see what he's trying to do. What are they cooking? What are you cooking? Okay. Both running solo on pieces. Give me this dude. Get this dude out. I think we're both cooking a little too hard. This is both the saddest and longest chess game I've ever seen. Sometimes the best move is just not to play at all. Go little pawn, go little pawn, go, 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 go! Go my little dude! Okay, adios then. was so young. Oh. Why didn't you kill my pawn? What are you doing? Your pawn can't go anywhere? Yeah, but like, Wicho might accidentally move that pawn. That's always a possibility. I see what you're trying to do, and guess what? It's not going to work.
Now your rook is in danger. Uh, can you stop backseating? This is a children's game after all. <laughs> you know it's serious when the king is the one on the hunt? Where's the timer? That guy was not safe. I don't know why you're just leaving him back there, but he's mine now. Okay. The misplays? Oh, baby. Oh. If only. I can't make it back there and not have that other rook take me, though. Chess comeback of all time. Let's go, baby. All right. I don't have many pieces, but you know that makes my job a little easier because I don't have as many places to go. I think I gotta move this guy. I don't want it to be taken by the other rook, though. I could start decimating if I really wanted to. Because my king is protected for the most part. I'm thinking I'm gonna move. Right over here. Is there anything he can do to stop me? There's one thing. This is chess is a is a game of of wisdom chat and I have a lot of wisdom. My mind is like a steel trap. Chia rook his skull. <laughs> Mods crush his skull, please. Yeah? You're gonna be a little piss baby and move your little... Your little rook there? Your reign endures. Next- wait, you resigned? You left?! <laughs> Woo! Yeah! I win! My game crashed, I swear- yeah, sure it did, buddy. I understand you couldn't take the heat and you got out of the kitchen and that's the admirable thing to have done. I think we play a new game. I'm gonna heart that. That was that was really some ridiculous chess. <laughs> I was this close to winning, why would I resign? I don't know. You couldn't you couldn't handle it, clearly. <laughs> What's my prize? How much for me to pay, play a minesweeper? That's a trick question. I never would. Let's play cookie clicker, but like in this game. <laughs> this isn't the same. This is not the same. Am I just gonna click on a cookie and nothing else happens? Yes, yeah, is, is this it? Is this- Oh! 
Now you're talking. <laughs> now what? <laughs> you downgraded the cookie? I didn't mean to. How do I put chips on it again? Is there upgrades? Did I- I won? I won the game? I'm waiting for something to happen. There's any minute now. Any minute now, something insane is going to happen. Gotta be honest, Chia. Yes, chat? I click the cookie. Cube sucks ass. And that's why I'm, I'm playing it. <laughs> Are you telling me you've never gone through like the Steam free page and just downloaded something to see how it would be? And now I get to do it and share it with the class. That's it. I don't think there is anything else to this. Why does it have so many hearts? This is better than Minecraft? You weren't wrong. I know. Just click on that cookie. Beat the high score. Uh, fire emoji, tongue sticky facey outy emoji, fire emoji. I'm gonna trap someone else into playing this, some poor soul. I'm gonna give that a heart. <laughs> My friend just made a steak burrito with fried mac and cheese. Cheese bites, and it was the best thing that we do not serve at our restaurant. That sounds delicious. You know. The best things served at restaurants are just the things that the people in the kitchen just make haphazardly. Just because they're hungry and they want to eat something that isn't served on the menu. Tamagotchi. Alright. I'll be the judge of that. This is like Dream but Bad. I never played Dream. Wait, this is Quacks, the Quake clone. <laughs> Thanks, Dragon. I literally just got here. I was gone for zero seconds. Give food. And pet. Those are my two options. No, oh, you're so happy. <laughs> Tamagotchi at home. This is this is somehow worse than Cube World, Arky. Believe it or not. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Guys, can you watch my dragon? I gotta take a me 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 me. Me 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 me. Make sure he doesn't die, please. I'd be so sad if I woke up and he was dead. Happiness is dropping. What do we do? I don't know, chat. What are you gonna do? Kill that guy? No, wait, don't. This is my beautiful pet dragon. Don't kill him. I thought she was gonna say something else. What did you think I was gonna say? Chat room. Sing him a song. Okay. Um. Chat, you know any good songs? What do you think a dragon would like? Maybe you should let the dragon raise a village or two? Uh, yeah, that would make him happier. Okay, who, who plays this? Sing him Imagine Dragons. Oh, he is a dragon! Ooh, the misery. Every single person is my enemy. Spare the sympathy. Cause everybody wants to be my enemy. E, 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 E. Look out for yourself! <laughs> my enemy. E, 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 E. 
Searching to behold the silence that is told. I don't know why that lyric came back to me and none of the rest did. Put my head down to the ground for the. I don't know actually. Tell you you're the greatest. Once they turn, they ain't us. Oh, the misery. <laughs> Can you sing a duet with the Germa video? I think someone did a full version of that. Watch, watch my dragon. Watch my dragon. Imagine dragons. Oh, the misery. I mean, this is that's gonna get muted. Do you think I can do it in the time that we listen to all oh, the misery? I'm just gonna get muted. This is... <laughs> is it worth it? What if I what if I get shut down? <laughs> Put on the karaoke version. The the karaoke version is just gonna be dun gun dun gun. So true. Dun, 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 dun. What? Hold on. Karaoke version. What does this actually sound like? Put on the MIDI version? Look at my dragon. My dragon is amazing. Oh, what an old song. It's just... It's not... <laughs> but is it just this? this is, no, it's not. It's not. I need to sing it. If I sing this, will... Can you guys be happy? <laughs> Should I just do this? No, like they will this, never this be happy. I'm do this for like a minute. I'll try. I don't even know how it goes. I wake up to the sound of the silence <laughs> that allows for my mind to run around with my ear a bit of the ground and <laughs> searching to behold the stories that are told when my back is to the He's world, really freestyling it. When I turn, tell me you're the greatest. <laughs> but once you turn, they hate us. He's finding it. Let him cook. Oh, the misery. There you Every go. Every single person. <laughs> oh. I even have the lyrics in front of me. The <laughs> lyrics are in front of me, and I still said it wrong. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I've said it wrong <laughs> so many times that that's the right way. Keep going. You just wanna... <laughs> uh, there is a full version, and I believe someone did, like, an edited, just put it to the tune of Imagine Dragons, so, like... It's like he's actually singing it. Chia, you're supposed to sing along with him? He, uh, chat, you think I could sing along with his version of that? His version of that is just so... It's a new song at that point. Like, I can't sing along to that. I don't know what's going on in his head. He did something completely different. I've heard him sing this more than I've heard the actual song. And that's how it should remain. Is my dragon, like, cutting a tree right now? What's happening? Oh, he was imagining it. Yeah, his vision is just on another level. I love how someone put in this clip as well the lyrics, like, as a, as a comment here. The Germa version. <laughs> I wake up to the sounds of the silence that allows for my mind to run around. I don't even know how he did it. But is it just this? <laughs> just do this? Like, do some fuck this? With my ear a bit of the ground, I'm searching to behold the stories that are told. When my back is to the world, that what was smiling when I turned. Yeah, it's just, it's, I can't, I can't sing along to that. So this is the entire game? I guess so. I guess you just wait for it to eventually die. I wonder if there's an actual game that isn't just a ripoff of a real game in this? 
What do you think, Chad? Eat your fruits? Oh, I love Snake. I know this is already like a real game. I know this is a game that exists, but like you can't frick up snakes, right? Hop on Space Race? How do they make Tamagotchi a billion times more boring? I know, Tamagotchis already are like... They don't do much. Oh, Now this? Is this a video game? Can you guys join my server and play Snake? Game. It's Game Jam. Oh, I- I- Oh, I- I, oh, 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 I get it. I'm gonna be the biggest snake. By the time anyone joins me, my snake will be huge and I will eat you all. Oh, Chia, that's cheating. Well, guess what? That's life. Okay. Room link. Copied. Can I- Can you guys join if I just put it? I swear this is not a virus. I hope. Can anyone just join that? <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Try to instantly kill me. Whoa! How is there a snake in- Oh, that's me. That's my body. I thought that was someone else. I thought that was another snake that just entered. I was like, you guys are fast and already huge. But no, I'm just a leviathan right now. There's slight physics in this. I'm having a lot of trouble going uphill now because of my massive body. The loneliness is already getting to her. Am I destined to be alone? Eating jam alone in this desolate world? Alone? You join but you don't you don't see me? How can you not see me? I'm massive. I don't see you. Read code, nerd emoji. Need help? No, I don't- I don't need help. If you're in, there's no way you can miss me. Well, I can go inside the house? I'm gonna try to coil myself up in this house. Like, bring my body into the house? <laughs> I think it's working. Chat will never find me in here. 10 out of 10 snake behavior. If I was a snake, this is what I would do. I'd find a house. I'd crawl into it when no one was looking. I'd coil myself up in the attic, and then I'd wait for someone to discover me, and then I would bite them. And not just like a regular bite, I'm a poisonous snake. I can't get up the stairs! Oh wait. I just had to climb my own body. Not sure this is multiplayer, but it's snake! It's supposed to be multiplayer! If there's no death state, there's no point in being the snake. You're telling me it's not multiplayer? Oh my god. Yeah, I think cube sucks. Mesh spacebar? I, I can jump. Wonder if I can like, get out of here. So, no one can join me. No one can be a snake with me. Look at how lonely he is. How can you say no to this face? I'm gonna jump off. It's the- it's the only way. It's the only solution. I'm sorry, chat. It's been fun. Well, not really. This kind of- kind of blows. Can't really say my- my snake life has been fun. 
has really been quite mundane up until this point. Goodbye, chat. That's the only thing left to do. Whoa! It just it forces me to be a snake. Can it can I not? Is there no snake death state in this? I'm jumping again. No! Adios. Like Sisyphus, am I am I forced? Am I forced to just keep climbing this desolate island eating jam by myself over and over again? No way out. Is this my life? Is this limbo? A baby game for baby gamers. At least chess was actually functional as chess. If you eat enough jam, the game will eventually break. You think so? How close are we? Like, how much jam? But you're right, eventually the island just won't be able to contain me. This music is so emotional for... <laughs> For being a little snake. Well, I guess he's a big snake. He's not so little anymore. I think you're probably not even close. I think so too, Chet. You can get so big your body covers each tile of the island. Holy moly. Yeah, but... Oh, there's my tail. There goes my tail. Adios. But why? My question is why? Like, what? what's the purpose? I thought this was gonna be games I could play with my buddies. My pals. Hop on Space Race Chat. I must be the only one playing this right now. I should check the Steam stats and see. It's a critique of consumerism, obviously. Yeah, obviously. Oh, oh, oh. I wasn't ready! How do I sh Okay, I found out how to shoot. I think. It's not really consistent. Let's go. Are, are you having fun? All right, this freaking blows. Let's play Lumberjack. What the heck? Sick game, Lamau? Uh, yeah, that was sick. That was so much fun, I had to stop before I peed my pants out of excitement. Yeah, when when did we get doing this? Now this looks like Cube World. My axe is too weak. Goes faster if you click it fast. Walmart Roblox. This is this isn't even Walmart value brand Roblox. This is This is like you went to a garage sale and found someone's game that they had like practiced programming on. I'm sorry, that's really mean of me. But is it mean if it's if it's if it's if it's the truth? Honey, we have Roblox at home. It's cereal box creepy pasta game disc. Yeah, when when is the jump scare? Hello, would you like to buy some wood? Get it? Wood? Would you like- would you- would you like to buy some wood? This is it. This is all there is. To this one as well, chop down tree, get better axe, eventually you could chop down all the trees. It has to be a crypto miner in disguise. 
<laughs> um, nothing's chugging. I I think chat. I think it's just an honest to goodness bad experience. I have jumped out of the world and it's not even respawning me. I'm just I'm here. I'm just I'm he I'm here in the blue. <laughs> All right. Surely there must be one game with a little bit of depth. I'm looking for the most likes. Pickaxes had 104. Action, jump, and use pickaxe. Different pick pickaxes will affect different parts of the world. That's just gonna be like Lumberjack, isn't it? We'll find it, chat. We'll find a game. Did you try the Doge game? No, I did not. There's a discount pressure wash sim game. Ooh, is is pressure washer on a? Is it on sale? Yo. Now we're mining and crafting. Mining away. <laughs> is this like the only map? Just the one with the little house? Yeah, this is the snake map. <laughs> Minecraft speedrun! Minecraft speedrun! Minecraft speedrun! I'm going to destroy the whole island. The island that kept me trapped here. I will destroy it all. <laughs> That's gonna be a lot of work. Wow, it's just like we're in the nether. Oh well, my god, I dug so deep. Are we gonna see an endy man? Yeah, you think? Oh man, creeper? Creeper, any creepers? I'd hate it if a creeper snuck up on me and exploded me before I got my diamonds. Ah! <laughs> It's okay, this time. This time I'll find the diamonds, chat. Oh, I'm gonna get some diamond Minecraft armor. Oh, we're getting real deep into this island's guts. Oh, you almost made me fall. Not today. I'm like a little mole person, burrowing, tunneling. Jarvis, can you play Minecraft Parodies playlist? Mining the way. I don't know what else I'll mine, I'll mine it anyway! In this Minecraft world, so beautiful. Mine on me. Mine on me, mine. Me on. I don't even know the parody lyrics. I'll find diamonds. In a day or two! <laughs> I'm going insane. This- this sucks as well! Surely, surely there's going to be a game with a little bit of depth. Surely. Surely, right? Are you QE? Thank you for the raid. Welcome, raiders. Welcome to this game that it, it sucks and it blows. It finally went through. Welcome! Yeah, I, I hear Twitch has been having a bit of trouble with raiding lately. How is your stream? I peep Minesweeper at the top. Surely this is going to be the worst game of them all. Welcome Raiders, we're playing some sort of Mafia front. <laughs> we're playing some sort of mon money laundering scheme, but like there's no way to insert your credit card. Great, it was so fun creating Pokemon Abominations. Oh, you're playing Pokemon Infinite Fusion. I wish I played that instead of this. 
She clicked it, no way. Would you look at that? I'm gonna click the bomb speed run. That wasn't the bomb? You, I don't think you can chain either. Or whatever that's called. Okay, when you lose, does it restart in any way? Hello, game? Hello? Are you are you gonna reset? Tiny play again- oh, a very tiny little play again button. Well, well, well. Would you look at that? You can't- you can't flag them. It says at the top, in the smallest, tiniest font. Ever. Bing bong. Ever. I don't even know how you guys spotted that. No flags, I can't. Yeah, it's a different field, so that's, you know, that's interesting that it randomized it. There's a timer and everything- whoa! How did you ever wind up playing this game? I saw it on Steam, I was like, this looks like it- It's either gonna be funny or it's gonna suck. Somehow chat got their wish of Minesweeper. I'm just- I'm gonna blow myself up. That's it. Get, get me out of here. I'm not playing Minesweeper. To completion. These are all the featured ones. Chat wanted the Doge one. It's so small. I know, it was so tiny. Okay, wow, we got we got more going on on the screen than we've ever seen before. I've got a hundred thousand coins. Is this the stock market? <laughs> this is a Bitcoin miner. <laughs> bye 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 bye. You know, buy low, sell high, right? Holy shit. This is a Bitcoin game. It's literally... I recognize the Dogecoin and the Bitcoin, but none of the rest of it. They actually have a crypto game featured. Buy the dip, quick! Ja I'm buying the dip! <laughs> I can't be bothered, just waste all my money. Okay, how do I make the stock market go forward so that, like, I can make money? Or is that the whole joke of the game is, haha, you spent all your money on Bitcoin and now you have no money? <laughs> What's in here? A door? Wait, that's not even a door. What? What? It, what is this? Working hard to buy more crypto. Am I- am I- am I crypto mining? I am! I'm- uh, chat, I gotta go to the mines, I'll be right back. Off I go. <laughs> Live footage of what a crypto mining program looks like. They send a little guy into your computer. This is what- this is what he does. He mines away. Incomprehensible? I can't believe that this is real. Gia, yeah, to make the stock market crash and still make money, you have to be friends with the US government? Okay, how do I do that? Me, me, me. Okay, let's buy. Does it ever change value? My brain is shattered. <laughs> what else? What else is there? I love how the, um, the, the guys selling you 
The Bitcoins are just like shady people, no faces, all dressed in black. It's, it's kind of scary, actually. This game looks amazing. Yeah, check this out. Kelby, look at all this Dogecoin I can buy. I don't have enough money to buy crypto, so I, I get to simulate it in video games so I can feel like I'm actually investing in crypto. That I, I would definitely invest in if I had the money for it. <laughs> Still better than Cookie Clicker? Oh yeah, this is leagues ahead. It's funny that they took the time to assign weeded values to the cryptos, but not bother to make minimal gameplay. <laughs> Okay, so I can I can buy and I can sell, but the value never changes. So ultimately, kids, what have we learned? Life is futile. Buying things to sell them at the same value is a futile effort. You're really just back at square one. What you really should be doing is spending all of your time crypto mining. This is how you make money. <laughs> Every second you are not mining for crypto, you are losing money. You are actively losing money. What is he even doing? I can't turn the camera in there. It, it becomes locked. Oh, oh. What the hell? <laughs> he looks so sad. He's looking down at his feet like, oh man. Oh man, back to the crypto mines. <laughs> oh man. It's McDonald's? Hey chat, can I take your order? It did not look anything like McDonald's. I'm surprised that someone caught that. Thank you. Thank you, chatter. So kids, what have we learned? Every second you are not working at McDonald's, you are losing money. Someone has 295 hours of this on Steam WTF. Is that a review? I want to hear the reviews for this. Can we interview that guy? Yeah, can we interview the insane person who has 275 hours in this? Like, they have to have left it open and gone on vacation in the meantime, right? Like, they opened it up, they're like, Oh, I'm, I'm gonna try this funny little game called Cubes. And then they just are like, Oh, oh, I gotta go on vacation. And they just left their computer running and the, the crypto mine running as well. McDonald's that day, crypto mine at night, the passive income is crazy. I'm I'm rich, baby. Time to blow it all on crypto. How do I uh, how do I get out of here? I hate how it makes you walk backwards. Woo! Yeah, what 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 am I gonna buy? Maybe not enough for Bitcoin, maybe one of these. Woo! Yeah, yeah. Alright, chat, I got eight hundred bucks again. I got nine hundred bucks again. <laughs> Are we having fun? Are we having fun? Chat? May I remind you, you're not under any sort of... Persuasion? To say a nice word? You're not under any sort of duress? You're having fun? Good, good, good. I don't have to kill you then. Would you ever play Ray Shadow Legends? Um, not even as a joke, because I don't think Ray Shadow Legends is a crypto miner. Erm, can I get some non-salted fries, please? Ah, oh, God. <sighs> Are you the kind of person that asks for non-salted fries just so you can get fresh fries? Just so you can make the staff have to work at their menial job just a little bit more annoying. 
Can I get a Sprite? Can I get a McDonald's Sprite? It hits different. This guy looks so sad now. Just so I can get some free spit on the fries, yes. Oh, I see, Chad. I, I, that's what you're doing. Frickin' get, get me out of here. I'm stuck in the crypto mines. I'm stuck in McDonald's. I'm stuck in the doorway. I'm stuck. Door's stuck. Door's stuck. Oh my god. Oh, thank god. Ow. I'm, I, I, I escaped, chat. I escaped. I'm fine now. I'm okay. I'm never going back to that McDonald's again, though. <laughs> can I get a milkshake? Hold the cup? Oh, yeah, I can hold the cup for you. Wait. Imagine if a McDonald's employee just brought out your milkshake in their hands. Like, no cup. Cupless. And you had to slurp it out of their hands like a dog. What did she mean by that? I didn't- I didn't- I didn't mean anything by this. Anyways, that was so cool. Um, heart, heart, heart. I heart that game <laughs> so much. I come to Q's to play Quacks. What is Quacks? What is Imagine? Why is this one, like, the top featured one? Repeat that? I don't even know what I said. Yeah, this is the OG map chat room. You're right. Okay. This game is called Imagine. If only I could imagine myself playing an actual video game. Is this just it? It showed some funny little critters and now there's like... It's a blank world? There's nothing. There's nothing! The thumbnail was misleading. Hi, KJ, hello! Oh, oh! Oh my god, another player! Hola! Finally! A sign of lip- Oh my god, another player! Hola! Oh! They're gone. Hola? <laughs> what is happening? Whoa! Um, I'm a little frightened right now, I gotta be honest. The game is no longer clickbait. Chad, yeah, there's- there's things happening. Hola? Error. Can't generate content. Is what my game says. You see down there? Whoa! It's a hamster! <laughs> wow! Whoa! So cool. How did you do that? Hamster jump scare. It's beautiful. I love it. Thank you for this gift. Hamster. How did they know? <laughs> I can't believe they put me in the game. Is this multiplayer? It is multiplayer. Um... Hi, amigos. Developers, help! <laughs> I can't believe three other people downloaded this abysmal game. Just for this. You press enter and write words and it makes it. Oh, so it's somewhat knowledgeable of like what the words are. Okay. Hamster. Make me another hamster. <gasps> oh my god! Why is the hamster sprite so cute? Another one! They're all different! What the hell? You think- you think they're AI generated hamsters? Yeah, like no way it's got- Three, no way it's got four different unique hamster sprites. Five different unique hamster sprites. This one's kind of missing his middle bits. Bitcoin, stop. Shut, stop it. 
Chat, stop placing bitcoins everywhere. <laughs> the uh, generated hamsters though, they're really cute. What are you doing, chat? This better not be another bitcoin. Okay, good. Good. Buy the- stop. <laughs> stop it! <laughs> Enough bitcoin shit! Oh, it turned it into some dip? What's being dipped into it? Is that like a lit cigarette? To the moon, Germa. <laughs> what will Germa be? <laughs> yep. Yep, looks like Germa to me. Jeremy Elbertson. I hope I spelt it correctly. He's growing. What? Where? Huh? He, he just disappeared. I assume he teleported away and of humanity stopped. Yeah, that's, that's dark. Alright, that's the end of humanity. Someone's over here placing hamsters in toilets. God damn it. It did say error. I guess it can't generate germa. There it is, the end of humanity. Huh? This is the Twitch logo. <laughs> it says, it says Till. I think it just generated a generic logo. You think it knows what a VTuber is? It's probably just gonna generate like a pot or something. Or like a jar. <laughs> That's my favorite VTuber right there! Ham with a- with a cheese slice on top of it. Cheese to meet you! Oh my god, I think it generated me. Is that a grilled cheese sandwich? I think it kind of looks like the innards of a sandwich, that is certain. Top of the house, Chia? Alright, I'm coming. Gotta make my way through this sea of whatever the hell that is. <laughs> um, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> it's the spitting image of me how did you do that arrow pointing it's it's me it's actually just it's me <laughs> soy jack pointing i don't think it's gonna do that one It's, uh, it's pointing up. What the hell? Wow, that's brilliant. Check, can you screenshot this for my NFT? That one hamster girl. <laughs> Is that how you got it? You said hamster girl. Hamster girl. I can't believe it. I'm actually having fun in this. Where is it growing? Oh, there it is. There it is. A fresh hamster girl. <laughs> it just gives them hair. Hamster girl. I'm making her a friend. Among us. Stop, chat. We're gonna make a little hamster community. Wait, wait, we have hamster girls. Can we have hamster boys? Hamster boy. Yeah, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? That one took a while. It's Hamtaro! <laughs> Buff hamster man. <laughs> This looks like sprite work for a new, like, hamster 
based video game. That's great. That's actually great. The hamsters are adorable. Hello, Kenna. Government assigned hamster girl. Can we give them a little house? Funniest shit ever. <laughs> I don't want to see that generated. House. Give them a nice little house to live in. Okay, what's the funniest shit? Oh. Error. Oh, look at that tiny little house. How are they gonna fit in there? Hello! Hello, hello, everybody. Mouse, wait, no, imposter. <laughs> Instead of making an animal mouse, it made a computer mouse. Is that Godzilla? But he's missing his face. Chat, stop placing bitcoins everywhere. Stop it. <gasps> Miku Mountain. Oh my god. And look at all those bitcoins at the top. Wow. Alright, we gotta fill up Miku Mountain. That's her name, Miku. I love that it knows who Miku is, except for these ones. That these Mikus turned out a little different. Hatsune Miku. And it's a Toho! With the Hatsune Mikus! <laughs> oh my god, that one is crazy. You think it, it knows other VTubers? The most popular VTuber in the world right now? Gar... Gura? Okay, I can't- I can't say that I see it. Shark girl? Yeah, that's totally her. <laughs> there! We- we have Gura at home. Is she behind you? Chat, you can't leak that! That's so- you- it's too early! Don't look at that. Don't- don't- don't look at that, chat. Don't look at that. Leaks. Oh, that's not Bakora. That's not how you spell that. Bakora. Don't, don't generate a naked... Stop, chat. Stop. I don't think the AI knows how to make a PP, but I'm not, I'm not gonna risk it. I'm going back to hamster land. Look at all these beautiful creatures. Wow. Surrounded by bitcoins. It's really, it's a... This says a lot about society. Pirate Hamster. Yeah, it's really good. Can you make another Pirate Hamster? We need to give it a ship. Pirate ship. It's growing. Yeah! Oh my god, they're so cute! I love the way it generates hamsters. There's- oh my god, there's more! It's a whole village. This one's got a funny hat and goggles. This one is sideways. The way it generates hamsters is beautiful. That's so funny. Spoilers? I'm sorry. Leaked. Leaked pirate outfit. I knew I couldn't keep a lid on it.
<laughs> this one's so good. Hamster IRS each <laughs> He's doing taxes! <laughs> He's doing his taxes! Oh my god, this one is is it's got a big sack of something. I assume sunflower seeds. Hamster soldier? We're making a whole hamster community here. <laughs> Chat room, stop! <laughs> Hamster Miku! <laughs> it didn't know how to take that one. It just, it heard Hamster. It was like, I don't know how to insert Miku into this. Hamster Fisherman? How about Hatsune Miku but a hamster? He's fishing! It had the pog face, yeah. This is so great. Okay, okay, that, that has Hatsune Miku energy. At least the coloration is like there and it, it's got a little bit of anime hair going on even though it's not, it's not Miku hair. It's, it, it's still, this hamster looks anime compared to the other ones. Mama Mia, Papa Pia, look at all these pizzas. We don't even have a pizzeria. Every time I look away, I look back, there's a new hamster to see. Behold. Realistic hamster. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah, that is a more realistic hamster. It's got a lot more um, pixel shading. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell is that horrible creature up there? That loathsome creature. Oh, is it eating a sunflower seed? I think. Hamster wearing shorts. Let's try it. Okay, we got overalls. That's close. <laughs> Look at all these ham hams. I don't want to leave this map because it would mean leaving behind these beautiful, <gasps> these beautiful creatures. This one's got a little sombrero. That's so cute. Yeah, all these hamsters are so swag. And then... You got me on top of the hill. Wow. Now this this game is cool. It's carried by the AI generating. <laughs> Alright, who's leaving their underpants here? Chat? Come on. Come on, have some decency. Get it together. Moby Dick. Hey. <laughs> I guess it doesn't have Moby Dick. Wait, what? Uh, yeah, I guess a whale. A white whale would do. Oh, that's cute. Chat, stop. No! You guys are getting more and more cursed. Ew! How come the face isn't filled in? Stop! I don't want to look at that. The void. Oh, this one turned out pretty good. This one's also missing its face. Some of them are just missing their faces. Oh, this one's giving this one a cookie and this one's eating the cookie. Yeah, this is the cube's redemption act. The only reason. Never- I take back everything I said about cubes being boring as shit. This is- this is entertaining. There, I said it. It's got one game that I am enjoying. 
I don't see it playing this for much longer, but it's fun to see what you guys are doing. There it is, a Toho Fumo. What's its version of a Hamigo? Yep, that looks about right to me. What what do you say that is? Is that like a bell? Weird bell? <laughs> what the hell? Is it's it's a little guy face with Goku hair? And another bell. Did someone say a hamster with a blue bonnet? Wow, this looks like a Tamagotchi. Where is the hamster with a blue bonnet? I've heard fables. I'm gonna make up here a hamster swimmer so they're ready to just dive off. Don't look at that, I miss- I mispointed. Hamster... Swimmer? Yeah, baby! That's adorable! It looks like he's floating on a little croissant. Let's try a hamster... Diver. It's so good at creating hamsters. Why is this so good at creating hamsters? It's more of a hamster surfer. Let him dive! Whoa! The, uh, whatever's generating these hamsters really got created with the colors with this one. I'm loving... I'm loving the yellow swim trunks and the yellow cap. But the pink fur, that's cute. That's cute. I like it. Oh. What you doing over here? <laughs> They're so cute. Minecraft creative mode. Hamster in bed. Ah. It put him in- he's like passed out in his food bowl. Honk shoe. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Oh, oh, we, we got really close to a Miku hamster. That's cool. There's just a little guy up here. He's just a funny little guy. Little guy. Two little guys being generated. Oh, two very different little guys. This one has three eyes. Good for him. One guy. Small hamster. That is just a guy. The small hamster is freaking huge! There's only one actual Miku? This looks like Miku. They all look like Mikus. Well, this one... <laughs> this one is a bit funny, but they all kind of look like Mikus. They gave Miku... The, the program gave Miku a little beard here, that's cool. Or like, the thing I used to do when I had really long hair, I'd make myself a beard, I'd like, bring it around my face. We have Miku at home. Miku at home? I have the bitcoins everywhere. Chat, stop. I love this little hamster community. <gasps> I don't know what he's doing, he's like on a... 
A grindstone or something, sharpening weapons. How is this AI generating hamster generator so smart at generating hamsters? This one's ready for vacation. Oh my god, they're so cute. I want to take them all home. Oh, a bush. Looks like toilet paper. I don't, no, I don't know what you're talking about. Toilet paper? No, that is not a hamster chewing on toilet paper, chat. Shh. You're only you're only seeing what you want to see. There's no way you can do this. <laughs> no way! <laughs> it actually did it. Oh god, what's this gonna be? Nothing, nothing. You can't swear, chat. You can't use bad words like shit. Hamster with a gun. It seems to be holding a fish? It looks cool, though. Stop. Stop saying hamster pooping, chat. No! <laughs> You're all jealous of my toilet hamster. Listen, I'm gonna do it again. Stream's over. Yes, yeah, go home, everybody. We got the hamster on toilet. <laughs> this one looks insane. Oh, this one's adorable. No, little guy, you're gonna fall in. It's gonna fall into the toilet. Omega hamster. <laughs> the Omega ham. Omega ham. The alpha hamster. What if you AI generate hamsters and it generates you? With enough inputs, if you were to ever search, like, a hamster VTuber, if I was ever, like, more popular, it would, it would just end up like me, eventually. Because, you know, it just, it pulls, it pulls a bunch of images and stuff from, like, a, a database. And there aren't too many hamster girls. So you'd have to end up in that database. Oh my god, all the bitcoins. They're just glitching in and out of each other. What's going on over here? A square hamster. Alright, close enough. Oh my god, I look away for two seconds and there's like a billion... Bits of underwear! Chat, you're disgusting! Stop leaving your pants so everywhere! <laughs> yeah, that kind of looks like a tracksuit. I think? Chat, stop! Don't plunder- the Chat, chat, this is not a reflection of, like, my soon-to-be- new model like if i the pirate model is not going to be stealing underpants i repeat it is not going to be stealing or plundering anyone's underpants hamster with a gun he looks so cool when you try to generate a hamster with a gun it gives it sunglasses like a hundred percent of the time wow these are violent hamsters very mature, Jet. Very, very mature. Is that how you spell drawers? K 
cave hamster. <laughs> it turned into like an unga bunga cave hamster. It's, it's got like a little little wrap of furs around him. Like another animal's furs. I have no idea what I'm looking at, but I love it. I, I'm addicted to this. Oh, it's Pikachu. I don't think you can generate guns. Yeah. A goblin? Yeah, I guess a goblin would live in a cave. Yeah, look at that guy. That's a cute goblin. He's got like a... Such a neutral face. Hamster with a pickaxe? Let's go. We got a whole hamster band happening over here? Golem? No. No, no, no. No! <laughs> You know what? This looks better than the golem game, honestly. This looks better. I'm definitely not in this game's limited database chat look. Stop, chat. I'm not a P-tuber. It just could not generate me. But apparently Chia P-tuber is some gross little, like, creature. With three legs. <laughs> you are not going to generate me. Yellow jar. <laughs> oh my god, it made a Vaporeon! Well, I... Well... Well... If you squint or had a really bad concussion recently, it's a Vaporeon. I'm just surprised it got, like, the general look of it. Chat, stop. It it knows what a Vaporeon is, kind of. Pikachu. That's definitely Chia, guys, look. I recognize that electric rat anywhere. I love how it gave it a rat tail. Raichu! <laughs> yeah, that looks like Raichu to me. That's not Raichu. No, that is Raichu. I remember Raichu looking exactly like that. Oh, that looks more Pikachu than mine. The cooler Raichu. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I love that one. Now this this would be a good like VTuber mascot right there. I love briefly what is happening. We're doing a multiplayer game. By game, I mean we're just typing in prompts into a generator and it's it's a Pikachu. What watch this? Watch this. You, those of you just tuning in. They got me in the game. <laughs> I just have Taro in a dress. Stop chat, stop with the P. You guys are obsessed. You guys are obsessed. But look, it can make Vaporeon. It can make Pikachu. It can make a hamster with a gun. <laughs> Who did this? Who made this over here? Out yourself so I can ban you forever. Those of you that don't know why, you don't need to know. What did they mean by this? What did they mean by this? Exactly! What did they mean by this? Who, who did this? What were they trying to say? What, 
What? It was one of yous. I know it was one of yous. <laughs> Yummy in my tummy. Stop, chat. No, don't drink that. Mysterious yellow liquid. Why did yummy in your tummy just make that? That's disgusting. That just looks worse. All right, I'm, I'm leaving. Adios. Adios. You think they miss me? You think they ever miss me? Where are they? I lost my amigos. Greatest game ever made? Look at all this nonsense. Oh, hi, fellas. What you up to? You're just kind of... You're all staring. Okay. I love this game. Yeah. Yeah, friendship with cubes now reunited. Hamster playing guitar, good one. Yeah, he's kind of cut off, but he looks rad. What are you guys doing? Okay. We may never know. I love all the different hamsters. Oh my god, this one's singing! Or maybe, maybe this one's about to just eat the microphone. I can't really tell the difference. That's a good one, though. Hamster robot, hamster kung fu, hamster taekwondo. Let's go. Hamster luchador. Oh my god. Hamster WWE? That's just a regular hamster. I think it can make a sun bear. Sorry, not sub bear. Sun bear. There it is. That's that's a sun bear. <laughs> that's what they look like, right? It is cute. What the hell? Is this a bear trying to lick the sun? <laughs> yeah, that is Zarky. She would do that. Okay, Jet. <laughs> why did it make the- why did it make the pregnant bear? Why? Why? Oh my god, this one's got a huge rump. Holy shit. Stop, chat, stop, stop. Stop it. Immediately. <laughs> stop, chat. Stop! You have violated the law! Oh, what is it doing? Okay, it didn't generate anything there. You think it knows anything from the Elder Scrolls? Um. I think it knows, like, what a Khajiit is. It made a cat! Wait, hold on. I, I need more space. We gotta try this again. Okay. Khajiit. What, what's another one? What's the lizards called? Argon Argonian? It does make just little cats for Khajiit. Odd Howard. <laughs> it made a lizard! It knows! Kind of. Hamster with a stop sign. Stop. <laughs> Hamster on a stop sign. 
Oh, that's really good. That's adorable. No, chat, stop. Chat room, Jarvis. Jarvis, kill the chat. Jarvis, stop this. We need a hamster stop sign emoji. Can you put that in suggestions so I don't forget? Because I agree. I concur. Huh? Alright, I'm leaving. Adios. <laughs> That's a funny one. I swear, every time I look around again, there's just new hamsters. Of different varieties. Never before seen. Oh, a sandwich. <laughs> Mm -mm -mm. What's going on over here? We got some some cute little scrumblos. Some more hamsters. The diving hamster's about to dive off. Miku hamster. Hamster eating a cookie on a plate because he's very polite. You gener wait where? These signs that don't say anything that makes any sense. We got fuel that way and we got... We got su sucks something that way. Stop with the bitcoins, you! I see you! I see you generating bitcoins! I see you just making non-stop bitcoins. Don't think you can get away with it. Subscringle. Yeah, that sign really says subscringle. Make sure you subscringle. <gasps> it's Arky. My picnic basket. That's what Yogi Bear sounds like, right? My picnic basket. I can't say it like that. <laughs> the voice act. It comes out all wrong. Look up. Whoa. <gasps> A hamster night. That's so. This is so cute. That's so cute. They're they're all so cute. Not the bitcoins. Don't don't look at the bitcoins. A hamster in a car. I know there there are so many bitcoins. I gotta get a better view of this. I gotta take it all in. It's me, a yogi bear. Can you save this world? Yeah, I don't know. I'll try. Is that a hamster drowning in a pizza? Is that a hamster in, in like a za? That's horrifying. As long as he's happy. Aww. It, it's, um... Yep. Oh. Aww. <laughs> These are cute. Keep going. Eventually it's gonna get it right. Yeah, it's just a hamster and a little cat holding hands. Hashtag life goals. <laughs> Oh, look at these guys hugging! That's so cute! That's actually like a okay generated ham hug right there. That's so cute! Aww. Do I have to stop, chat? What the hell? Why is the hamster crying just massive and shaped like that? These hamsters are smooching! Chat, look away. You... That's not appropriate. Oh my god, there's so many hamsters making out over here. Chat, don't look! You're, you're not supposed to see that. That's not appropriate. Duping the world means duping bitcoins as well. So true. Yeah, how about a firm handshake? Oh, that's rad. That's, that's whenever me and Arky get together. The boys.
Can I save this? Chat, I don't think I can. Well, I, th I think we can by the room link, perhaps? I'm gonna put this in the Discord and then we can we can check back if it saves. Yeah. I'm just gonna stick it in Discord general for now. There's gonna be some people who are gonna be like, hey, did Chia get her account hacked? She's posting random links to weird websites that definitely look like Bitcoin miners. Hamster running at you? Oh my god, ew, why is it skittering like that? It's like hunched over on all fours, skittering. Stop. That, he's got murder in his eyes. These are so good! No, they're covering each other! It's an ethereal work of art, a moment in time never to be recreated. I guess so. This is just... It's an art exhibition. Everyone's just off doing their own things. Someone over here has just created a scene. A little hamster haven. This is ham society. Who keeps adding undies? Oh god, don't tell me there's more. I see, I see the text there. Someone just keeps saying undies over and over again. Maybe this was a mistake. Who, who are you? Stop it. I see you in the pile of undies. Don't think you can get away with- I, I see you. Stop generating undies. I, I see you right now. You're generating more undies. Get get out of here. Go. Shoot. 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 Stop. Stop. Sexy undies. Oh my god. I'm going I'm going to kill that guy. Get out of here. No more generating undies. Got it? Oh my god. They are impossible chat. You see what I'm dealing with? You, you see? You see what I'm dealing with? Can someone do a ham pog? We have so many hamster pogs around. There was a really good one. Um, that's a pog. We got a pog here. The AI really likes to make the hamsters pog. There was... There was one amazing... Here! Here. He's pogging. Do you think it can do a proper, like, Pog champion, though? Pog. And then we'll try a Pog champ. Okay, the, it just generated some sort of bowl with a red lump in it. It can't do a Pog champ, chat. Soup, 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 soup. I think someone here might be a bit hungry. Yeah, I think it is making meat. So that's what a pog is. I love the hamster just blocking and hoarding all the soup. Chat room. What does that even mean? Rat. <laughs> rat. There's just some rats with the hamsters. Little imposters. I'm the giant ham that makes all of the rules. The clown. The clown is really good. This is really good, except for the bitcoins and the undies. This is really good. Chat room, thank you for this work of art. Cubes had a redemption arc. I'm I'm very happy to have seen it. I'm glad. I'm glad it got this chance to show that it is capable of being something. What's happening down there? 
I just see a bunch of text bubbles and things falling. Can we get a nerd? I'm um, actually him. Oh my god, a rap- Stop making rap piles, chat! Nerd emoji. Hamster. Hamster. Nerd. <laughs> Look at the nerd emoji. Oh my god. <laughs> Lamau nerd. Uh, um, actually. <laughs> Um, actually, hamster nerd. Yeah, the nerd hamster is adorable. Please look forward to my new outfit in the Chiaverse, nerd Chia. This one didn't turn out as well. This one turned out so good though. Four eyes looking ass, leave him alone! Leave him alone. Hamster cyborg, okay. Nerd boat. <laughs> wow, this is a twofer. This is a nerd emoji and it's soy boying. There's so many rats. Yeah, someone was just having fun generating a bunch of rats. Erm, actually, this is this is my chat's face every time they get to correct me on anything. They go mad with power. Um, actually... Me, when Chia reads something wrong. <laughs> oh! Oh, that that's you! No, not Minesweeper. Get out! No, not Minesweeper. Stop. Oh, angel hamster up on top. That's cute. <gasps> There's even hamsters in the house. Someone was busy. Oh, oh, there's something very wrong with this one. Oh, no, it's a, it's a regular cat. I thought it was a weird long hamster. Wait, is that a little ham pile? Oh. Don't you think they need a bed? Jarvis, generate long hamster. Long hamster. They got a little Minecraft bed and a, a long hamster. What if we put our Minecraft beds next to each other in cubes? What would you do if we put our Minecraft beds next to each other in cubes? Kitchen. How is it at generating wasps? I don't know. Wasps. That's a nice little kitchen shelf. Oh, that's a giant wasp. Did I really have to make it so big? One million dollars. <laughs> I swear. If that was another Bitcoin. Just need some more canvas to generate a wasp. Hi, Snackle. Ew! Okay, yeah, it's good at generating wasps. Wasp girl. Oh, we had the same idea. Wait, the one on the right is just the bee from a uh, bug fable. That's funny. Worm. Uh, you're just making a worm. Wasp, but massive. Whoa, that is a big worm. Stop making massive wasps. They are unsettling. All right, this this will now be known as Bug Mountain. That's why the hamsters are trying to dive to safety.
Oh my god, who's creating all these glizzies? They're not... You have to put in hot dog, chat. You can't just put in glizzy. It's not gonna know what that means. The god worm is too big. You, you STF, you, chat. You shut your freaking gob. You, you, you little, you little guy. Or I stuff a sock in it. Or my fist. Just hamsters, as far as the eyes can see. This is wild? Yeah, it is. Alright. Well, thank you, chat, for joining me. I'm going to go eat supper. As much as I'd love to keep typing in prompts to make new and more insane hamsters. I hope you had fun. I know that I did. I'll be back tomorrow. Just when you think you've gotten enough of me wrong. I'm back, baby. I'm back tomorrow as well. What are we playing tomorrow? Whatever's on the schedule. I forget what I wrote on the schedule. I forgot. Amazing stream? Yeah, I had a ton of fun. I like playing bad scrimblow games just to see. Make sure, yeah, make sure you check out Twitter and Discord if you want to stay up to date. I will be back tomorrow. I will see you tomorrow, so don't miss me too much. It's fun. It is fun. I'm glad you had fun. Bye chat. Adios. We're gonna look for someone to raid. Adios. Say goodbye to all the hamsters. Say frick you to all the bitcoins. Goodbye hamsters. That's a really buff wasp over there. All right, all right. Enough, enough distractions. Enough distractions, or we're gonna be stuck here forever. Adios. Goodbye. See you tomorrow. Maybe it is a Bitcoin miner. My CPU just sudden, suddenly started chugging. Oh my god, I think Twitch rating is broken. Weird. Weird. You already have a raid, okay. 